Happy Tuesday! Woo! Holy shit! How is everybody? Do we got White Bat playing us in? Life is good. What up? I see a lot of first time chatters. Welcome to the goddamn party. I think I got everybody. It is too early in the week, Gallows. I feel ya. I'm feeling much better. Uh, is this stream night quilled up? No, 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 no. I'm at the. Uh, uh, if I have any any residual stuff, it's it'll be a little sniffly. That's about it. I'm all good. All good. Back in action. Who did I see? We, there's been a lot, dude. It's been a week. You guys have had and not guys. A lot going on here. Kind of crazy to think Atlas asked me yesterday when's Halloween? And it's right it's right around the corner. That's kind of crazy. It's the end of August. What the fuck, dude? It feels like May to me. What up, Suds? I'm not ready for Halloween yet. I'm, I'm kind, I'm 50-50. Part of me's like, wait, what? where'd the fuck the rest of the year go? And part of me's like, bring it, bring it. Maybe I'll just, maybe we're starting it now. Maybe today's the first day of Halloween. Yeah, I caught some, uh... What a fail more? Oh, you're still you're still sparring on, on the Steam discussions. What up, Shin? People were in the chat right after your announcement. Uh, oh, and on Discord, let's go. Yeah, I did see that, Shin. Diehards. Diehards. That was mostly just a buckle up. But hey, here we go. Also, Shin. How the hell are you? It's always shit time somewhere. Vexento, I didn't sing. Hold on, let me look. Or did I? Uh, oh, I do remember looking at this. Yeah. I might hit them up. I'm very reticent to use anybody, no matter how royalty free they claim to be. Uh, because I've uh, been stung before. Times change and people's royalty free status changes. Then I get fucked. And it's not a nice fucking. It's a harsh, unsensitive, painful fucking. <laughs> what up, Nips? Did a raid come in? We've had a couple raids. Karate Chop coming in. Hold on. Where's our... Uh, Vexinto, though. Uh, Sing, I will... I'm going to hit him up.
I'm always in the market for good, uh, good tunes. Good looking out. What up, Synchro? <laughs> go raid chilled. <laughs> let's do Let's go. What up, Zalant? Psycho, I haven't played Armored Core since the first one. But I played it to death. So I don't know if I don't know if I'd call myself a fan, but I remember loving it. That, that was when I was like, wait a minute. You're telling me this is the Tinchu, guys? Are you shitting me? You're about to get a USB alert on your computers. It's not you. It's me. Okay. Final road to, to road to global nips. That's ambitious. <laughs> no, I'm sticking with my road to adequate and any rank. Fleeting, don't worry about it. Stuxnet. It was Stuxnet. Long Wolf, you want me to as a reference? Wait, you need references when you get drafted? Why do they give a shit? Um, hi. Hi, is this Sark, uh, mister? Yeah, this is the U.S. Army, yes. We were just wondering about Log Wolf's uh, ability to do push-ups. Oh, dude. But, yeah. I'm looking at him right now. Holy shit, look at him go. Oh, he's going to be great. <laughs> like the resume you fill out for the for the army. Uh, I did see the new bean game. Looks hilarious. It's not a replacement for bean battles, but I would love to see the resumes people fill out on their way into basic. Dude, that shit would be so funny. That would be insane, actually. Uh, holy shit. Uh, I saw some people also just getting over being sick. Some people getting over being super sick. Volklin, I saw Vega in here. I need to get CS2 access before APL. You know what? I... I don't give a shit at all. I mean, I'm excited to play CS2, but I don't give a shit about getting in early. But to get it before APL? You're absolutely right, Sink. Get it, get it before APL? I'm silver, you motherfucker. <laughs> Nick, Nick, I saw you. I saw you putting in time on Chainsaw. Is it good? Two, two different questions. Is it good and are you enjoying it? In that order. I picked it up. I've, I watched the, uh, the lads play while I was sick Friday a bit. It looked kind of cool. Yeah. I actually like that it's asymmetrical and not like 4v1 or whatever. It's a true story. Someone who was in the army got a phone call from a Marine recruiter while he was still in the army. It turns out he put him on the form even though he knew he was already in the military. In fact, the Marine put seven names. Oh, he recommended to the army seven people that were already enlisted that's hilarious god the easiest troll ever 
It's more dynamic than DVD, many more options to escape. But what about prop night? Someone's watching me in a plane. Plane Wi-Fi from Last of Faith. Holy shit, dude. It's like Stickman Golf up there. <laughs> Prop Knight can die from Enpin. <whistles> would you ever make a blackface emote? It would never be approved, Macaroni. Yeah, dude. Typhoid Mary Otter. Uh, Gallo's hooking me up with some uh, <laughs> medicinal cash. Leorio, uh, thank you for the dono. I have seen it. Schlatt's a made man. He's rocking it out there. Keeping the dream alive. A white face emote. Where's the good one here? I mean, that's the white. That's the whitest shit imaginable. That emote is probably racist. I'm surprised it snuck through. Um, hold on, we got to get caught up. What am I playing today? We're playing a uh, the video game jukebox is going, but I'm, I was feeling um, over the week and watching games, games and. Games and games come out that I wanted to play uh, and not be able to play, so I piled them up. So I've got some spooky, uh, some spooky games backlogged. Also, some ones from ages ago. We're gonna say we're gonna run through it, see what we got. I've also been stuck. Nick knows. I think that uh, I think. I think Nick is down, obviously, but my, Nick, did you notice the chat, the group chat goes silent every time I put one of our race war games on, I link a new race war game for Friday and everyone's like, oh fuck, please no, <laughs> there's, there's more <laughs> coming out. I even told them, like, it's not going to stop for a year. There's so many horrific only up clones. Probably my favorite one that we haven't played yet is Bald Man Climbs Up. That's a mood. <laughs> I know, Nick. Dude, everyone's chatting. Tat, 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 tat. And then it's like, hey, Bald Man Climbs Up came out. Let's rock it. Silence. Who is it? It's a goddamn potato raid. If you got the potatoes. Let's see them. Dude, a little psych jam is the perfect. What up, psycho? The Vanginas are going to ride again, psycho. I'm still sort of, I'm the, the update I want for, for Phasmo is the scares update. I don't think that was this one, right? I'm only about halfway through your, your breakdown of the latest update. But it's back on the menu. We're getting back into it. It's been so long, it's like a new game for me. Yeah, Psycho Hypnotic popping in. Just a Swiss Wonderkin. Infin wins every race war. He does. The scare updates in 2024. That's what I, re I remember. It was still a ways off. I'm still I'm still psyched about this one, though. Technically, this is the better update, I feel like. But. Yeah, and if you ever want to watch some high level Phasmo, Psycho is. 
he, he's on the he's on the Mount Rushmore of Phasma. In my opinion, Phasma players. All right, here we go. Let's uh, let's get everybody shouted out. Alan Wake Two, key. I missed it because I was getting stream ready, but I did see Little Nightmares Three at uh, at Gamescom. It looked dope. Dude, those games are so beautiful. I, I do need to watch the Alan. I've, I'm hearing good things about it. Psycho and Insim. Yep. Little Nightmares 3 is not out. They just revealed it in Germany this afternoon, Melody. Oh, no. I was never the one to watch for Phasmo. I was always a step behind, but dude, I fucking loved it. Um, Psycho, I'm doing good. I'm on the tail end of being sick. I feel great now, but I've been sick for the last week. And uh, so this is my first stream back in like a week. Thanks for the raid. Thanks for popping in. It's got to be like latest shit for you so i appreciate it all you taters always welcome uh we're just playing uh, a little bit of uh oh. we're just checking out some spooky games today could be good could be bad probably bad What's the background from? It's some pixel art that I saw on a uh, on a music mix. It's like a very short GIF. I don't like that it hitches actually now that I'm looking at it. I can clean that up. Um, yeah, so bring your hazmat suits. Your, bring your anti-epileptic uh, medication or like a leather strap. Bite down on a wooden spoon if you're an epilepsy. Would you say Psycho's knowledge of Phasmo rivals Hutch, Hutch's Aquaman battle in terms of scale? Oh, wow. That's a real apples and oranges, but yes. Yes. Because Psycho has 11,000 knowledge, Phasmo knowledges to Aquaman's 10,000 undersea units. Checkmate, Hutch. Psycho, don't worry. Don't, forgive the comparison. Don't even worry. But you don't, you don't want to know. You're great at Phasmo. That's the, that's the long and short of it. <laughs> Bad idea to try and checkmate Hutch. True. Phrasing, I take it back. Uh, hold on. We got Mellow Puff, Ark, Lil Fish, Linus, Aura. Lil Fish at the tier of two. I see a bunch of 40 months coming in here. Lane. Um, Gothic, Carry. Sword in Darkness. Carrie feeling better, I'm glad to hear. Country Mac, Sea Pig, Robo Ritsu, Jess, Obsidianini, with the bits and the dad joke I saw earlier. You're probably back now, Obsidian. You got the pre-stream timeout? Holy shit. Hold on, ENG did a raid earlier. This is for ENG. Oh, wait, and I see ENG. I took an ele epileptic girl to a rave. I jokingly told her, I hear this place has rave reviews, but she just rolled her eyes at me. God, that is so sweaty. Fuck it. Thanks for the raid, ENG. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Killer Christmas tree. Brandon uh, was playing audio while cutting up some trees. I did a little of that last week. Oh no, I'm hard again. BG, thanks for the resub. Uh, I mean, thank you for the 40 months. Oh no, I'm hard again. 
Spaniardy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. For the gift bomb. Wong Wolf, of course. Harnessing. Face grinder. Get it, priming the shit out of me. Macaroni with the resub. Agent Joker. Obsidianini. Here we go. Three moles in a tunnel. Head I mean, I, time I, I timed them out. It's only fair I read it. There are three moles in a tunnel heading toward a bakery. The first one says, I smell sugar. The second one says, I smell cinnamon. The third mole goes, I smell molasses. Why wasn't that delivered by ink, Obsidianini? No pause with the raid. When to go, Aristide. Yes, I defeated the T-Virus, finally. Ender Jacket, White Dad, Peacemaker, Calignos, Sniping. Thank you. What about uh, what about the Sark? Oh, Uncle Shield. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It feels good to be uh, to be to be live here. What up, Arctic? How's it going, Flanzy? How are you? I see you. Shin was in here. Fruticos. I might I might have missed it, but thanks for. Uh, Thanks for the heads up. You're out of here. Fionix, Obero, lurking. No, briefing clock is lurking. Homicidal cookie, big T gamer. I might lose my voice. Bin game, bin game plan, Andromeda, bread and bunny. Gallows, of course. With the uh, Nike Will Ginger Ale Chicken Soup Fund. Appreciated, actually. Hit, hit all three of those. Gallows, you know. Did I ever play My Friendly Neighborhood? Affirmative. And I really enjoyed it. And then we went berserk at the end of that. Uh, it should still be in the VODs. I did not see the cringe guy storm the games comp stage. I'm going to have to watch that, Stab. I'm sure there will be no shortage of recaps. Have I played Baldur's Gate 3? I have not. Do I plan on playing it? Yeah. I don't feel compelled to at the moment, though. But I know failmore has been grinding it. I don't know if Failmore's in chat still. Um, <laughs> God damn it, Gamma. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm going to play it. I'm going to play it. Zane, Greg... Drozdov, Geo, Last of Faith, Ezri. Oh, Last of Faith on a plane to Texas. That's right. I forgot you are uh, inbound. With candy corn, just in case. <laughs> That's hilarious. Leechcraft, Psycho. Oh, Psycho's in the, in the middle of some shit here. Muscle relaxers and pain meds. Okay, all right. Other Psycho, Psycho Rot. What up, Beaver? Tech Split, Mel Bear, Silver Synchro, ENG, of course. I can't stop shouting broccoli and cauliflower. I think I've got Florette Syndrome. So glad you're banned, ENG. See you in a minute. When, I, when I'll ban you again, even though that one's actually way better than the rave one. <laughs> it is a chat full of psychos, Deep House. Um... Hold on. Ralph is potato. Sing bat with the Vexento. Wreck. Karate chop. What's up? We're about to get started here. Thanks for popping in. Ellie lived through the hurricane. I know. It seemed fucking crazy, Ellie. Congratulations. Zara, I hope I hope you stocked up on canned goods and TP, and like line boarded the windows. It was fun and weird. Yeah, yeah. Dickerous. What's plugged into the wall behind me? I know it is aesthetically unfortunate, but that's a uh, index sensor. Fruticose. Here's the Fruticose bits. 
Skeleton walks into a bar, says, hey, bartender, I'll have one beer and a mop. This is the first song I used in my Zombie Army 4 Challenge video. Yeah, White Bat rules. Uh, Android Bishop, Yurt, Scotty, Hotshot. Is Steam still down? I got all my stuff installed before the Tuesday maintenance, so I'm not sure. So, Hotshot, appreciate it, by the way. I'm glad I'm feeling better, too. Silver Synchro with the bits. Thank you. Hotshot hooking up Nips, Lewin, Cody, Goosey, Dude You Know, Phoenix, Mad Havoc, Pyro Taxi, Starfield. Maybe. We'll see, Aristide. We'll see. I'll decide once it's out. Yeah, I appreciate it, Hotshot. Good looking out. Mavi, No Time Off, Ms. Sulfi, Smitty. A recommendation could be the difference between infantry and games in theory. The army wreck, or the, the yeah, the, it's true, I guess. But here's the thing, I was mo mostly joking about how funny I think the resumes that people fill, fill out for themselves. Is your background a Pokemon Wildfire? No, it's like a, it's just like a moon, it's like a night, pixel art nighttime scene. Kind of cool. Yak, Neo, Farce, Johnny Boy, also recovering here from surgery. By the way, Poppy went in to get fixed today. So she's going to be all coned up and woozy. We might bring her up a little later. But, dude, everyone's getting, everyone's going down. Otter, thank you again. Zero. Trollin, of course. Zero, giving some love to Fleeting also. Also, high Fleeting. Of How are you? Sixth Doctor. Oh, soon. Soon, Doc. Soon. We got Boggle, Rottenbury, DeWeasel, V Sheds. What's up, my little chickadees? That's right. My voice couldn't handle uh, Wolfman Sark right now, but. Braden, Braden hitting 40. Grimly. Psycho for the raid, of course. Socrates, Petty, Legito, Frenchie, Dude You Know, Bondi. What do you call a factory that makes okay products? A satisfactory. Where are you? How dare you? How dare you? Hilo McFly, is that right? <laughs> With the resub, Spaniardy, Pierce, ENG, Worst Island. We're in the home stretch here. Flux, Cuddly Fruit Bat, of course. Black Tuna, Ray. What games are you looking forward to? I don't know. That the uh, Payday and MK1 for Lane Brock. I mean, I'm thinking sight unseen. I'm thinking Alan Wake, but Little Nightmares kind of uh, got me hype. Starfield. I mean, I, I'm as optimistic about Starfield as I am about Stalker 2. It's like, it gets a please don't suck from me. Out of five. Peg junk. Laziest pirate. What did the janitor say when he jumped out of the closet? Shit. Peg junk. Thank you, by the way. The triple OG. That's just elderly at this point. What did the janitor say when he jumped out of the closet? Supplies. That's the laziest. That's the only thing you put in chat. You resubbed, dropped that shit, and we're like. <clears throat> I was BVF streaming right now, fleeting. Jiga in here? What's up? 
Aru. Whoops. <laughs> uh, Asari, Fruticos, Cormier, Cormier, maybe. Good Burger, heck yeah. Filleting. Heck yeah, I'm, uh, I'm feeling much better. Good old Greg with 420. Good ex Mormon tag, search, ponder, spray and pray, call to swerve, Gordon B. Stinky, Elder Bad Touch. Ooh, those are great. Nice, Greg. Holy shit. I'll have to think of some. I think you I think you're you've already got a fucking first draft going here. Gordon B. Stinky. That's a deep cut. Pretzel Sniffer, Falcones, Frothy, Miss Frothy, Frothe. I put a little French on it. Nova, feeling much better. Thank you. Rufy, Suds, Pond Scum, Fixel, Crucifix, and that do it, of course. Last of Faith from the Plain. I found out today my dad joined a biker club. No dad joke here. Just proud of my. Po Shit, I was fuck ready to ban you. Okay, found out today my dad joined a biker club. No dad joke here, just proud of my pops for finally being happy and feeling like he belongs. You're out of here. You're fucking out of here. Did you just use the word dad and joke in the same, the same fucking comment? You're out of here. Dude, you know, thanks for the bits. Utah, here Give we go. Two. Let's try these out. <clears throat> There's a third installment in this little uh, would-be franchise that's in the pipeline. So I figured we would go back and check out the uh, previous titles. Thank you. Thank you, Faith. Have a good have a good flight. Land the plane. Uh I have, Greg. I have seen the uh McDonald fake out. I've seen a couple of his actually. What's that? You've got a dad? You're out of here. Cantaloupe. <laughs> oh Jesus, Cantaloupe. Okay, hold on. No matter how many times I hear dead jokes about dead children, they never get old. You're out of here. I feel like we've heard that one before. Warzone with the resub, White Fang. We're playing some uh, mixed bag today, White Fang. Some older, some newer. Just feeling like vibing with some spooky games. Leather Nugget with the resub. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Sounding more and more like Duke Nukem, yeah. Okay. Let's get OBS on board with what's going on here. Saffy! I'm so glad I looked over and saw it. Okay. Oh, Phantom! Chaos in here. Romansylvania will return. Um, I just didn't feel like playing it today. Definitely gonna come back. I was thinking about this. Holy shit. Is that an Augie alt? What up? Say Roblox, Augie. God damn it! You're out of here. Uh. Oh, that's your main. Oh shit. Dude, when you when you're hitting, you know you've gone through some handles. When you're hitting like a 48 character random string of letters. 
They're like, shit! Scruffy Fruticos. Fruticos is back. Hold on. All right. Hold on, I'm reading. Oh, and, and ENG. Oh, and this is the perfect bookend. The perfect bookend for the dad joke arc here. Because ENG came in. Oh, what up, Fleeting? This is on your wish list. Yeah, it, I've just been sitting on it for a little bit. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I have no uh, frame of reference for whether or not it'll be uh, decent or not. Why does the music sound like a Western instead of horror? Because it's a Western, actually, Zira. You're about to see. Um, Fruticos, this graveyard looks overcrowded. People must be dying to get in it. Fuck, I wish I had timed you out for an hour. Shit. G. Carl Hongus with the resub. Read between the W's. Oh, am I missing a fuck the Da Vinci code? Uh, Cuck Boy Crew. Cuck Boy cr cra Cram. Seven. Cream. Cuck Boy Cream. Seven. You you had yeah. There's a seven at the end of that. How many WCW WCWKBWOWYWCWRWEWAWMs were there, Augie? How many? <laughs> when you have to put a seven at the end of that shit. Jesus Christ. It's like a, it's like a Dan Brown clue. Da Vinci. When they flip when they flip the Mona Lisa over, they just see a string of W's and C's. Robert Langdon's like, huh. "It might be an anagram." ENG with the bits closing out the dad jokes here. I told my doctor I was having problems with my memory. He made me pay in advance. God. ENG. Hope shit's good. I want you to know it feels good to time you out, though. Martide, thank you. Got my sneeze guard. D Tom, Shalissa, Jinx, Guac, of course. What is up? Where's the? There's the guac. You can always see the guac, the the vibrating gold tornado hat, and Mountain Dave. I searched a list of ten puns to find one that makes you laugh. No pun in ten did. Why did I read that when I said I wasn't going to read them anymore? Here we go. Survival and horror, hangman's rope. Let's see what uh, let's see what it has to say for itself. Are you ready to uncover the secret of the cursed town? Immerse yourself in the ambience of the Wild West and its mysterious events, and discover the truth about what lurks on the grim streets of this town. Oh. <coughs> And there's a few survival and horror games. Oh, we might play the next one right after this. And there's a third one not out yet. So let's see. Let's see what we got. The next one's pretty good. Okay. Is that the next one? Or is that the third one? Let me see. Prisoners, yeah, that's the next one. And then coming up is their sci-fi one, Undead Space and the Damned City. What's that one about? Just looks like a modern urban horror. 
Res Evil silent first person silent hill alan wakeish vibes we'll see how these go honor games out there doing the lord's work 1902 oh, here we go it's fucking 1902 it's a dark night it's fog blankets everything around town around the <coughs> dense Dense fog blankets everything around. The train, speeding towards Kansas, unexpectedly slows down as the silhouette of a person emerges on the tracks in the distance. The engineer has no choice but to brake sharply. However, as they approach the junction, something unknown mysteriously derails the train. Wh what? Whoopsie! causing all the carriages to overturn and hurtle towards the nearest town. Uh, uh. What up, cantaloupe? That's not very Western of you. Jesus. Wow-wee. <laughs> the, engineer, the engineer steps out of the cabin and looks around carefully. When he tries to leave the city, the fog thickens and Richard finds himself near the train again. Richard. Okay. That must be. Okay, got it. We are Richard. We're Engineer Dick. Realizing that he has no choice, Richard decides to head into the city and explore the local houses in search of survivors. Yeah, that looked. That, I mean, that. That looks like an, an engineer. Classic engineer. Uh, not recommended for the first time. Let's do normal. I believe you. It is strongly recommended not to skip this text and memorize the game rules. There's no crosshair in the game. A true cowboy shoots from the hip. Mm -hmm. Important. By igniting phosphorus, you deal increased damage to enemies, but be cautious. As you, this is like the ending of a pharmaceutical commercial. You deal increased damage to enemies, but be cautious. Use it only when necessary. This way you can si save bullets, but phosphorus may be needed for incorporeal, incorporeal enemies. Incorporeal enemies do not react to bullets. To kill them, you need to ignite phosphorus and shoot. Alternatively, you can kill such an enemy as shooting a from which it emerged in case you run out of phosphorus. Important! Q, check ammo, tab, and target. That's a lot of rules to memorize. Q, check ammo, tab, inventory, right mouse, add phosphorus. I'm going to be doing that accidentally a lot. Uh, important, important. You can ignite lamps and houses as well as relight your own lamp from a burning one. Okay, here we go. Ink, what's up? You missed a bakery joke earlier? I tried to get a job at... Oh. Okay, Ink is clearly just joining the party. We're going to read it. The bread baker themselves. I tried to get a job as a conductor, one, conductor, conductor once, but they didn't think I had enough training. Oh, man. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate that you said that. <laughs> Last of Faith, I promise it wasn't a dad joke. I dropped a picture in inventory. In, in, in the <laughs> inventory? Is that like where fucking babies are buried? In the, uh, in the infantry only chat in Discord. Copy that. I'll check it out. Cantaloupe, thanks for the reggae. Grats again, though. You, got, you basically got shit canned for the meme of it. All right, what do we got here? What's our what's our sensitivity uh, sitch? Okay, let me dial it back on the mouse. Do I have? Uh, oh, oh, I do a bit. Okay. <laughs> And Kokomo coming in here. Goddamn birds. Here's my update. 
how much NyQuil did you take? Uh, I can only do, you know what? I can only do NyQuil for like two nights before there's diminishing returns. Like by, if I do it like on a third night, I just don't feel that sweet oblivion encroaching. But here's my update since it's been a hot minute. Got a job. Cashier food lion. Wish it were a dad joke, but no. Oh shit, Kokomo. Grats. I've said so many dad jokes, never gotten canned. The one time I mentioned my dad, I'm out of here. Did you just, last of faith, did you just use the words dad and joke in the same? Get the fuck out of here. Order a drink from the, your the f flight bar. Thoughts on Deadwood, okay. Buckle up, Petty. I don't think Deadwood. Just kidding. I've never seen it. Even worse than me dropping a hot take and shitting on Deadwood, I haven't watched it. I know. It's a goddamn fucking crime. You know what? I'm going to write it down. Just like I've never finished Breaking Bad. There we go. This is like a confessional, a TV confessional. <sighs> I did watch Boil Boiling Point last night. And I feel like I might never have been more anxious. Maybe like Uncut Gems, Uncut Joms. Or, uh... Good times. <laughs> oh, I hear something. What are my what are my options here? Oh. Um do I have forgot? Try this. Fruticos, what exactly is this game? We're discovering it together. It's a Western. I mean, this this is reminiscent of some old Resident Evil type stuff. I'm not instantly seeing a ton of uh, assets that I've seen a million times before. Oh, shit. Got some range. Firm tur, good to see you. I'm not going to say it, Firm. What up? What up, Dick? Dark just happened. Oh. Oh. Oh, I need to... Phosphorus, matches, little whiskey. This is good. You know, let's do a little. Let's do a little test. A little phosphorus, cha. Okay, must just be for. Just for chills. Is this the colonial level from Only Climb? That's right. We've made it. We've hit the 75% uh, mark.
Okay. Elements universal imbrocation. Stiffness, aches, sprains, bruises. Shove some elements up your ass. God, Western medicine was so dope. Just take heroin. Oh yeah, good call, uh, Gallows. We've got 11, and I've span I've like Call of Duty reloaded a couple times, so I don't think we're actually dropping them on the ground. Good call. No way. If morphine won't help you, heroin certainly will. Okay, sun is just coming up. Look at this. There's that's a sunrise right there. Oh, here's that's a bright sun. Oh, the sun is setting. Oh, none of it matters anyway. Okay. A save slot. Let's do it. Boss. Boss. What is up? Thanks for the. Uh, the gift bomb here and the 39 months. Holy shit. That puzzle might, that might not be how the puzzle goes. That was just a first stab at it. We'll see. Lovely Bean, thanks for the resub. <laughs> are you, are you feeling sick too, Bean? ENG with the bits. Thank you. I got to read it. It's ENG. I just heard my ex got a job with the railroad. At least now she'll be paid when she pulls a train. ENG, how does Twitch not think you're a ban evader at this point? Pucker with the 666, Baumer. <laughs> the joke, that, the dad joke, police. Fleeting. Some B days have passed while you were dying. Oh, fleeting on birthday patrol here. Hold up. We got zero. Dude. All right, dyslexia can be a bad thing. I don't have it, but here's what Fleeting wrote. Zero celebrated, Zero's birthday was Sunday the 13th, and Vegalip was this past Saturday. Here's what I read. Zero celebrated a birthday Sunday the 13th, and Vegalip passed this Saturday. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Vega. The circle of life, all in one fleeting bit donation. <laughs> Toxic Avenger and Dauntless Bunny at the tier of three, a middle-aged sub. I love to see it. Anti-Able Bunny. Thank you, Anti-Able Bunny. Thank you. For sh thanks for turning up. Hockey guy as well. It, working on that second year. Um, here we go. Survival and horror. I like the idea of, uh, uh, of what this dev is trying to do. Making like a little, it's almost like what, what they wanted to do with the Halloween movies for Season of the Witch. Like turn it into an anthology series. Right? Before Michael Myers. Thanks, Rez. Yeah, I'm feeling much better. 
So the like this group of games all has survival and horror with a little ampersand like it's Bed Bath and Beyond. And then they're just making little like I think bite size games of different settings and shit and fitting it into the I don't think they're connected. Anyway, I kind of like that idea. Chase, thanks for the resub. The S tier gaming. I don't know about that. Do I have a jump? I don't have a jump. Um, let's see. How did I end? Dude, that's a hell of a wreck. If this is the train that I just ate shit on. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Faith, welcome back. Oh, this is where I was. All right, dude, I'm already turned around. I'm already turned around. A few days ago, I woke up with a spider on the wall next to me. Kept it glassed for a few days. I would have glassed it and the room and the... The street. Oh, it's a little low. Holy shit! You have one second from the moment of the attack to ward off the ghost. Okay, so presumably I alternatively could have shot this body, but I, I was out of bullets. All right, well, there's a good phos phosphorus lesson. Oh, uh, my face cam is blocking shit. Hold on. Okay. Oh, here's the... Right? Sort of Resident Evil-ish. Can you combine stuff? Um, yes. I don't have anything I think that is worth combining yet. These are all sort of one use. Light the light the lantern. Turn the lantern into an anti-ghost tool and heal. But yeah. Attacks on trains. Sus. Uh, reminds me, I've be been getting notifications once a week on an outside camera. It's always a spider dropping down. Ravage sent me a uh, screen cap of a spider doing that at his place. Hope to God it's the proximity to the camera that makes it look so big. Otherwise, I'm burning my house down. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. I missed the... Uh, kept it glass for a few days from Zukotu, then released it. Just woke up after a nap before the stream. It's back on the wall again where I can't glass it. This time it dies. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? That's a... That's a learning moment. Glass first in the, like, starship troopers sense. <laughs> Shit! I tried to shoot the body! <laughs> Let go of me! I'm out of bullets. I'm so fucked. I got a stab. Oh shit, it hits me with the fucking Dark Souls. And the fucking condescending. Uh, you might want to read the. Re memorize. Alright, alright, okay, game. Alright, conserve ammo. Hard lessons are being learned here in the West. It was a harsh time.
backwards, we go this way. Do the dance with the, with the fella. Ow. Oh, shit. Okay. That's the room with the lever upstairs. Let's go in here. What the fuck? Sorry. Youf. Uh, about a week ago, we were leaving a friend's house, and a big old spider made a web right in front of my fiance's backup camera. She about shit herself trying to back out of the driveway. Oh, yeah, yeah. I haven't had that happen yet. That fucking is unfortunate. Youf verse drunk Filipino. Chase and Vladdy. Take a little uh, look around here. Nice. <clears throat> Why is there a trench going through the middle of town? Uh, not sure. Maybe they, dude, I mean, when you run out of places to mine, you dig up the street. Uh, holy shit. What was I saying before earlier about Boiling Point? That movie fucking ruled. But if you work or have worked in a restaurant, I, I was so stressed out by that shit. And they're, they're apparently making a short, like, episodic follow-up to it. What up, Amir? Yeah, Boiling Point, if you've never seen it, is a true one-shot film. There's not too many of them. Filmed in 2021. Um, in one take. No little uh, Hitchcock. What the fuck? Like rope style cheats, cuts, or, or uh, Sam Mendez cuts on wipes, that type of thing. Anyway. <coughs> it was nuts. How was the editing? The, the behind the scenes, what up, Dornado, by the way? The, uh, I, I looked up a few little tales of the production. I didn't find anything too comprehensive, but it sounded fucking crazy. They had to get, like, official, like, uh, permission because they were using police. They were, they were using so many. Everyone had to be mic'd up, and the sound mixers were live swapping between characters because as the camera moves through the restaurant, you'll... It'll be talking to two people, and then it'll break off and follow this person as they go to the back of the house or whatever. And the audio mixers are, are doing all of that live, and they had so many wireless mics that they had to have some type of like local permission to use as many channels as they were using. And then they had budget for eight takes. Homeboy, who who's the the head chef, had just wrapped up in the Venom movie. 
he's incredible. He's the English actor from Irishman. What's his name? I need to I need to not not know his name. Stephen Graham. Pervert! What up, dude? What up, dude? <laughs> Darnado, thank you. Shell, Laker, Howie. Pervert Raiders. Anyway, yeah. Stephen Graham, he wrecked it. They had a budget for eight takes. They managed to shoot, and they were shooting. So they were, it was like, Tons of weeks of pre-production to get the thing ready, obviously. And then they had two weeks of pre-production with the cast. And one week of pre-production with Steven, who had just come off of Venom. And then and they'd asked him, do you need a break after Venom? And he said, fuck it, let's just do it. Let's just finish it. So they did. So they dove right into it. They did four takes, two a day. So... Not, not consecutive days, but they did two takes in one day. Then they reset everything, and a couple days later, they did two more takes. And then everything got shut down for COVID. And if he'd said, no, I need like a week off of after Venom, they wouldn't have been able to shoot the film. Anyway, it was fucking cool. Yeah, it's so good, Tornado. Got greedy. Bite the lint. Fuck. I could just attack the ghost, I guess, once the phosphorus is gone, but. What up, llama? <clears throat> Love that it was only an hour and a half too. I mean, yeah. I, I guess it, it probably felt like to them. It probably felt like a three-hour epic. Shooting it. Oh, Myrtle. It's called Boiling Point. If you read the description, it probably sounds super boring. But I, I would most closely in, in vibe compare it to like a Safdie Brothers movie. As far as it being like unrelentingly tense and anxiety filled. <laughs> Aru. I think so too. I don't love the... Uh... What's going on back here? Why is this... Is that just the lantern? I guess it's just the lantern. It looks like a tactical nuke going off behind the the post office. What's my health at? It's fucking not good. Okay. What's my ammo like? 23. Okay. All right, we can do this. Range on these fuckers. Oh shit. I was gonna try and loop around, shoot the body. 
I don't have a radical, so my gun's a little unreliable, but... I watched Vertigo again while you were away. All I could say... <laughs> you son of a bitch! I'm a f- I'm a one- I'm one shot. Okay. Right click to make them go away. Yeah, I have limited phosphorus though. Doing okay on ammo. Uh, would love a bottle of whiskey, though. Find firearms. Holy shit, that's where it's aiming? Science. Gotta play Chainsaw. I do want to play it. July 10th, here we are, we've moved. That was a fancy ghost. Oh, and you're tucking into the rum? Mariel, thanks for the uh, resub and the well wishes. Feeling much better. Grim, thank you for the prime. Llama. <laughs> That's right, 40 months, Llama. You were ahead of the curve on that founder's badge. Uh, let's see here. July 10th, here we are. We've moved to my husband. My husband John has found a job at a rare phosphorus mine. Phosphorus is found here in small quantities is used in agriculture and the chemical industry. John, John tells me about the challenges of extracting phosphorus, but he takes pride in his work and believes it'll bring benefits to this land. I hope our life will improve now. Mariel, drive safe. August 24th. I still can't believe what I saw yesterday when I arrived in the city. I'm haunted by Anna's screams as she was being dragged to the gallows. I was too frightened to do anything, but now I feel so powerless and overwhelmed. I can't understand why she was executed. Wait, you just showed up into town and saw a hanging? Axe head. Ooh, let's take that. Could that could that be a lever? A lever, even? I need to look how 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 many I think that's those I think those are giving me like one bullet each. <laughs> yeah, that's the that's the walk to the hanging. Hi Anna. I'm just Okay. That's the barn. This is another gun shop. I need I need some whiskey so bad. You have infinite bullets here, okay? Can I close this? No. Do you think editors are artists? Holy shit, Guac. <laughs> Gallows, yeah. 
It looks like Finian's rainbow, but it's to a hanging. I guess this is just to get acclimated here. <laughs> tornado. I I don't know tornado. I I don't remember. <laughs> Pant Sassin with the resub. Oblivion Sing hooking up Neon, Jayhans, Hunted. Did I see the seventh guest PSVR trailer? I don't know if it's a new like Gamescom trailer. I did not see it, but I have seen something about that. Cool boy. We'll have to do it. Hey, Sark, could you let NATO know he's not a real artist because he's an editor? Fleeting. Said that. Can fleeting candle, filleting candle. So in some circles, known as. just window dressing let's combine with that very handy if you need to break something okay I want whatever is in this goddamn drawer Save me the match. What up, Nihau? Yeah, I, uh, I mean, dude, exploring seventh guest. Eleventh hour in VR. That shit would be hilarious. Or thirteenth ghost. What if? save. I need some whiskey and this seems like prime whiskey territory. Oh shit. The new Path of Exile League, Genja. Save. Mm. 
We'll start using a new slot on the next round. Okay, all right. Progress. Gev. Gim, actually. Jim. <laughs> I got it. Third time was the charm. What up, Jim? Got to go to bed. UK time. Peace out. Gev. How did I... Jim. Have a good night, Gev. Oi, Gev. I can't read. Um, let's see. Where'd the shotgun land? It's on four. Okay. Oh, you suck. Get the bar. <laughs> I fucking do it. Okay. <laughs> Kite him over here. This game has it all. Survival and horror. We'll see. Winchester? I don't know. Here, we'll start a new slot here. Nice of them to do that from a mile away that time. statue you gotta check your bussy at town hall before you come in why should I leave my bussy here when I see everyone else with their bussies out town rules we 
gonna have issues. Pussy boy. <laughs> the unbroken safe. Here we go. Oh, and he has a, uh, a fellow artist, Tornado. That's nice. <laughs> there we go. Welcome to Pussy Town. Do you have a revolving pussy or a double barreled pussy? I don't know if I'm. Like, wise oh, let's get some more. to be saving the shotgun. We'll see. What am I up to shell wise? Four. That's not a lot. There's a uh, beta. Fle fleeting is baiting the uh, editors in chat. If I say, oh, hey, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, it stun locks you. Run. He's gone, so I don't have a way. To, so now it's phosphorus only. Okay. All right. Let's see what we got here. Um. Probably this is Anna. Holy shit! Booking dot. Piop. Vreeder, Piop Vreeder, I, I probably mangled that. Thank you for the prime. Pio, Pool Boy, Fleeting, Filating, Norse, Pedro, smells like nerd in here. Filating is uh, just subscribed. So we've got multiple candles turning up. Jim, peaced out, perplexed Bard with the resub. You missed the dad joke trade, Bard. Trader Gabes, thank you for the 29 months, Bard. Trader Gabes with the resub. On the heels of a cross-country move. Nice. Congrats. Ninja and Clint. Uh, you haven't missed anything, Clint. I The last couple stream, last week's streams, I was sick. So this is my first stream back in a while. And LeCare with the resub. Cut her down. Oh, well, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Why am I? It didn't even occur to me that she's not standing on a board. I'm like, dude, maybe we've got to get her down. Fuck you, Anna. You're done. <laughs> what up, boy? I'd buy that for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Son! 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 Let's get the candy corn out. <laughs> and the Marza 
Is that her name? Martza? Baltza? Baltza was the dog, right? Cool, I like that. Anna's house key. Okay. Oh shit. August sixteenth. Yesterday I got I've got drunk and suddenly I had an intense desire to pervert something good. I left the church and the first thing I saw was Anna's healer house across the road. I headed straight towards it, intending to defile her body. Oh, how she screamed. It was quite satisfying. But that cursed bitch threatened me with a curse. How dare she? How dare she? Who, do, who the fuck does she think she is? Can we just stop for a sec? Just gonna go around cursing people willy nilly? What a fucking bitch. Anyway, I love good character writing that makes me feel something. Like how selfish Anna is. Anyway, <laughs> on with the raping. I must admit, it bothered me. Who knows what she's capable of? In any case, Leaving her alive's no longer an option. It's unlikely anyone would believe her about me. Oh, hey! <clears throat> what up, suds? Is Streamlabs busted right now? It might be. That one looked like it went. Fish lips with the resub. Suds. Oh, did it just pop? Sud! 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 It might be busted, actually. It looks like it's lagging a bit. And cantaloupe <laughs> with the dad joke. King Gigantor. Fish lips. All right. Anyway, where were we? Oh, yeah, I was journal... Not me. <laughs> I was voicing the character journaling the, their rapey ways. Oh, what up, Chaz? 30 months. Oh, yeah. It's unlikely anyone would believe her about what happened, but it's better to take precautions. August 17th. I spent the entire day in the church thinking about how to punish that witch. Oh, yeah. Over the past few weeks, a drought started in the town, and all the crops are dying. What better reason to accuse Anna and demand her execution? Of course, people will support her because she helped many. Healed. I don't give a damn. Don't give a shit. Here, I decide who lives, who suffers, and who dies. And nobody interrupts my raping with some lowbrow cursing. Goddamn witch. On the same day, I gathered all the townspeople in the main square and accused Anna. Many seem to believe me, but I won't be satisfied till her cold corpse hangs in the square. The sheriff suggested conducting a vote and collecting signatures from the townspeople. I have a plan for that. I'm just gonna sign the same paper. A hundred times. <laughs> August 23rd. Finally, my vengeance has been fulfilled. Today we hanged that bitch. They gave me the key to her house to consecrate it, but I think all her possessions should be burned. Ah, what a delightful feeling of power and control over these pitiful little people. Wow. <laughs> Hold on, I need more water. <laughs> this dude... <laughs>
a sympathetic villain like Thanos, you know? Where you're like, you know, I kind of see where this, where this, uh, this fellow's coming from. I felt like defiling something. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Ah, uh, defiling. That's rich. What do we got here? Oh, shit. Good timing. Candles. Adventures in Desert. That's the new, uh, the new MG Gallows Jam. Adventures in Desert. Necromantic as fuck. <laughs> Dune 2, Joss. Okay. Daddy, yes, absolutely. Uh, I haven't played Quake in a while, Rosal. I haven't even checked. Is Quake Live still? Oh, I don't have the lantern because I'm using the shotgun. Psycho, have a good night. I did not watch the uh, QuakeCon finals, though. QuakeCon is one of my... Uh One of my favorite cons. Dude in Old West Town. Yeah. It would be. Let me go light my lantern again. Stuff them. I need lots of shells for this. It's so weird that the uh, you would right mouse the phosphorus lantern ability and not just put an iron sight on your uh, on your old west shooty guns.
All right, so now I've got an axe. We use the axe. I'm still in the market for a lever for that house back at the beginning. And we've got the key to Anna's house. And a big old town square here to, uh, to search. QuakeCon. Yeah, QuakeCon is super fun. I've always liked... Gamescom is fun, um, but some of that novelty might have been... Because uh, it was a trip. It was travel for us to go to Germany. Which is awesome. And some of my fondest memories are there. But I've always liked the conventions generally that focus on one thing. So, like... QuakeCon, it was it was never really about the announcements at QuakeCon. It was more about the, like, bring your own computer hall. Dude, that shit was... It was just a, basically a big LAN. BlizzCon was always fun because I, I haven't been in a while, but when I was going, it was mostly WoW. Because um, Diablo was in a lull. Um, and Evo is electric, also. Dude, watching, watching, like, Justin Wong at Evo, or, like, the salty sweet betting, throwing money down on Daigo, dude, that shit is so good. Pre Diablo three, uh, was it pre? No, no, no. I did, but I I went after Diablo three. Blizzard hates Diablo. Did I just fucking don't? Oh yeah. Okay. I'm using up all my. What's up, Vital? Been over a year. Yeah, these guys, they, uh, the enemies have, like, a really huge swipe range. Spawn. Oh, Dirk, I'm not sure. What do we got here? Mm. A 
I'm going to need a key here. Oh, a wizard room. Speaking of wow. You know what? I remember one of the BlizzCons that I went to. It was the... What year was it? It was the year that the dude who made this... I went to several, but... Oh. Please don't be deceived If you've seen this Please don't be deceived By my current situation As unlikely as it seems I'm a PvP sensation a legend in my time, not a legend in my mind. So if it's all the same, don't make me get my man. Make me get my man. Dude, when they drop this, though. It was fucking chaos. You don't believe I'll arrange it. Anyway, that's called uh, Don't Make Me Get My Main. If you want to, uh, here, I'll put a link in chat. If you want to watch it. People fucking flipped. Note in the diary. Wait, this is somebody new, right? Some type of... To summon the soul of a deceased person, you'll need fresh grave soil, which can be found in, in any cemetery. Cemetery. Church candles. The personal belonging of the deceased. The place of the deceased's death. And the triple toll of the cemetery bell. First, it's necessary to strike the symmetry bell three times. Then, within the vicinity of the place of death, candles are placed in the shape of a tri triangle. In the center, I don't know what this fucking dumb accent is. In the center, the personal belonging of the one being summoned is placed and covered with grave soil. <laughs> oh shit, immersion. Yeah, there we go. Then, the name of the deceased must be spoken three times. What's the timeline where we get the good internet, Myrtle? Wait, my good internet? I don't even I don't even know what that is. Uh recent it August seventeenth. After yesterday's incident with Frank, people started gathering in the square this morning. I opened the windows and heard them talking about me. Frank was shouting Oh it's Aunt that I'm a witch. <laughs> Oops. And that the whole temp, the, the whole, wait, did Frank get it right? Did rapey Frank get it right? This sounds pretty witchy. What if Frank's superpower is that he knows whether or not someone's a witch after raping him. Where was that guy in X-Man 3? Anyway, Frank, Frank was shouting that I'm a witch and that the whole town is suffering because of my unholy power. It frightened me. When I stepped outside, many people turned to look at me. I started saying that I'm not guilty, that I'm not a witch, but I am. <laughs> And that I would never do anything bad to any of these people. Could be true, actually. Franck looked at two guys standing next to him, and they approached me, dragging me back into the house. They told me they would stay here to prevent me from leaving. Franck warned me that if I tried to escape, I would be executed before the vault took place. <laughs> what up, youth? Phantom! Hold on. When Phantom gets back from the ad break, it's 
Let's get them subbed. Hold on. Here we go. Nobody tell him. Nobody tell him. <laughs> what what's what's Harry doing? What the fuck? Harry, I got you. So anyway, in the evening, James came to see me. Dear James, he said he wouldn't let them hang me. I believe him, and I'm very grateful for his support. I'll kill him last. <laughs> I like James, and I think, I think it's mutual. I believe he can help me. August 22nd. Damn bastards. After everything I've done for them, this is how they repay my kindness. Just now, Frank announced in the square that all the townspeople voted for my execution, and it will take place tomorrow. <laughs> is this on a single piece of paper? <laughs> it's really small writing. He claimed that the sheriff... Ah, uh, James. Did he really betray me? There are no bounds to my despair, and now people will experience the wrath of a good person. I'll have to resort to an ancient ritual. I hope no one's dug up those bones I prepared a few years ago just in case. After the crowd dispersed, Emma came to me and brought me some food. I've changed my mind. I'll kill Emma last. Righteous cunt. It seems she was the only one kind to me, so I warned her that after my death, vengeance would befall the town. She can do whatever she wants with that information, miserable little bitch. Thanks for the tamales. Okay, all right. I'm just saying, Frank got it right. Called it. And she was like, don't make me get my main, Raper. Don't make me get my main. Wicked. Hold on. Did I miss some? I did. Chaz, Disney Magic. Working on that second year as well. Templar, Grunky, Paka. Daddy Jacob, definitely going to play some Phasmo, Daddy Jacob, yes. Grod, Kenny V, Zvital, Natural Death, <laughs> listening in the car, Turbo, on Night Shift, Turbo, nice. We got Wolf Warrior, Darius, and Stoned Phantom. Oh, shit. I mean, dude, what happened, Stoned Phantom? It's crazy. Harry Lizard, of course, Ideal Pal, and Wicked Smart. Um, what an incredible time to hit inventory. On a scale of one to fucked, how screwed am I right now? What timing? Um, okay, reload that. Is this using a match every time? It might be. Don't make me get my main. I'm a PvP sensation. Perfectly good axe right there. On the other side of a locked door, but still. What the f <laughs> I mean, some of these little events are kind of cool. Need a key. Sheriff's department. That's where s sweet baby James. Used to live. What up, foul? Have a good night, ninja. Let's do that. And this. And this. And we'll try and conserve a little ammo. Got a 
fight against Cowboy Dalsum. It's a weird mix, Jigga. Yes! Today was a tough day. I woke up early in the morning, had a little food, and headed to work. Lately, I've had to dig graves every day. <laughs> and I hope they burn in hell. There's a gang of killers operating in the city, and in the past month, about 20 people died. Their bodies horrify me. Some died from bullets, some from knives, and some are strangled. Sometimes I wonder where their souls go after death. Don't you? <laughs> August, August 26th. They hanged the local healer, Anna. It's a pity. She won't save me from a deadly illness. I decided to prepare a grave for her. And she was definitely not a witch. That's where I'm definitely supposed to be going. I feel like I missed something back here, so I'm just gonna go back in real quick. I need a key for the sheriff's office. Bank is locked. Like, did I do that? I think I went, I beelined straight to Anna. Can I actually put my candles down here while we're Maybe the, this is the place of death. Maybe I could get it, get it ready to party. No. <clears throat> okay, so these are phosphorus only. Okay, and I don't think I can get to town hall. Yet. I need to get across the uh, ravine here. Cut. My impression of Chris Tucker. It's probably about as good as the rest of my impressions. Fucking perfect. <laughs> Sing. It could end up that way one of these days. Hey, Tony, Tony, nine and one, not a bit, not a bad thing for the for, for, for first time we're playing with the controller. Okay, good. Uh, don't know, Biggs. The only thing I can, like, sort of go with story-wise, it's a mining town. Maybe they, it's like the Dwarves of Moria. They dug too deep. Um, yeah, okay, let me do this. Oh, did we drop? Hold on.
Are we back? Stream dropped momentarily. Not internet, though. So it must be the switchboard service. Here, let me put a refresh in chat. Filleting candle, hooking up toaster. Nash. When's Chilled going to shoot the stripper and drink all your health potions? Thanks, Nash. Mr. Nobody. These sweet hillbilly tones come for me in these trying times. And we've got the official Van Eyes in here. Wow. Tier 89. What's up? How's it going? Trivial Paradox, one chest. And then, of course, Beans. We know where this is going. Beans comes in. I feel like we as a society don't praise Tango and Cash enough. That's why we weren't blessed with the Tango and Cash cinematic universe. A cinematic crime, by the way. I'm with you, Beans. But I am resilient, and I will always hold out. Try another refresh. I don't know what's going on. The internet is fine, but this uh, restream service that I'm using called Switchboard keeps dumping. Whatever. We're, we're in it for the long haul tonight, so we're just going. Nova, Metro, Cowabummer, Coralion, Kerne, Absolute. Poseidon, Fridge, One Dead Angel, and Chempo. Thank you. Welcome. Oh, shit. The ISP is attacking the, rest the restream service. I know. Well, I got reset anyway. I got hung up on a piece of geometry in the uh, cemetery and got fucking wrecked. So, yeah, Rory, you're going to need them. You're going to need them need em all. Hazmat suits and a, a marked lack of epilepsy. I got to start looping back and saving more, too. Dirk, thanks for the resub. Or sunglasses, that's true. You know what, since we've just cleared this room, let's resave. Let's get to start playing smart here. And, uh, have a good night, Gamma. Yeah, we'll see. I'm going to keep the window open now and see if, uh... If it keeps clowning me. Um, if you're just hopping in, we're playing um, Hangman's Rope, the first in the little miniature anthology horror series on Steam in the survival and horror franchise. Um, the setup so far is that, uh, we're an engineer and a train derailed as we came into this town and we're uncovering all the tales of bullshittery that's happened here with a rapey mayor slash pastor, maybe not sure. Maybe a pastor, a good witch who was living here and then executed for being a witch. Um. 
Yeah, Turbo, we watched it on stream. Oh shit, goat, nice. <laughs> what up, Tommy? How you doing? Nosk? The alien clicking impression? I don't even remember that one. I can't do a predator purr. I wish I could. Ozzy with the resub. Dirk as well. I could do Sebulba's pod racer though. Uh, before we uh, continue though, since we just died and uh, I've got a fresh save, I'm going to hit the head. It looks like people are filtering back in here, so you know, the internet's clowning me. Tommy, I hope shit's good. Miss your face. Void, it wouldn't surprise me. But, hey, dude, we're going, uh, I'm going to be on all night, so. Um, let me play some music. Be right back. Yeah, the predator like purr. They do, it's like the it's like um it's like a deep cat purr. Yeah, be right back. Grab a beverage, pray for the internet. What up, hey Zeus? Yeah, I just had an internet dip, so we'll see. Fingers crossed.
I was gonna bring Poppy up, but she's too uh, she's too out of it. Dude, animals with animals with cones on are so sad. Cubanino, what's up? Hey Zeus, I feel like I feel like this is representative of a lot here. This is my internet service right now. I think she's a little uh, dosed right now, too. All right, back to Hangman's Rope. Let's get through this. We can do this. I, I, I need to respect the game more. What am I at bullet-wise? 638. That's tons of ammo. What up, Switch? Trolling? Oh, I'm so glad I read it before I said it. Trolling. Thank you for the bits. Um, Switch. Uh, this is Hangman's Rope. One of the survival and horror games on Steam. I'll put a link in chat. Um, trolling, you beast. Crashly, how's it going? The bonks. Bonks were on briefly at the beginning. Nothing but respect now, game. Uh, what's the game like so far? We're an engineer. We've our train has derailed. We've stumbled into town, and it looks like a bunch of bullshit has gone down. And uh, we are now, it's looking like it's building up to us doing a little bit of a cleansing ritual. Holy shit. Stand up! Stand up! Why three? Why three that time? Um, the the combat is a little uh, a little wonky. Don't love it. Does this take a match? No. Okay. But uh, I mean, overall, it's not terrible. I don't think. Yeah, and then the lore is wild. All right, we got to go building by building and clear this shit because I've done it all and I don't want to do it again. Eternal Evil, uh, this guy's first game was Eternal Evil.
Holy shit, you're right. I remember that game. We played that game. I think doesn't this predate Eternal Evil or no? No, it doesn't. Wow, he's cranked out a bunch of these then. Yeah, Eternal Evil was good. Was that Hank the Hank fucking game? <laughs> Fleeting? <laughs> I didn't go in here last time. Yeah, that game, uh, that game was good. Explodey with the resub. Start streaming on live space. APL found a new buddy to talk Coheed with. Oh, man. Just friendship blossoming in the strangest, of, most unlikely of places. All right. Building cleared. Game saved. Bought an old game today. Shadow Man Remastered Tank. Okay. Right. The backstory is he made this game with the full knowledge it was going to be ass. He wanted more money to support bigger projects, so we pumped out these games to support Eternal Evil 2. I mean, these little... These little games are... Better than some of the trash we play. Good on him. If this is the cost of uh, getting an Eternal Evil 2, hall hallelujah. Okay, that was a net gain of ammo. Got three bullets off that guy. Okay. Oh, you know what? There go the bullets. Dude, this I'm gonna. This is I'm gonna put. It, hold on, hold on. I'm turning on the reticle on my monitor. Okay, now I have a reticle. I'm gonna aim. Holy shit, where did that even go? I'm just curious how fucking wild this is. Uh, let me find a mark that we could do a test shot. Okay, I'm going to aim at this spot. This little Australia looking shape. Dead center. So it's like a foot down and to the right. Okay. Utah! Give me, Give me two. two! Hold on, cantaloupe! Ho, ho, ho. Now I have a reticle. He sent out a Steam updates page in the early month of this game's free prologue. People weren't happy, but he basically said, don't care, lol. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's a fucking... That's kind of a shit place. What about the place at the beginning where you had infinite ammo? The little shooting range? I mean, I could... Yeah. This is fine. This this worked. So it's like down. I have to aim high and left. 
Lars. All right, so we've got uh, save point in the church. Hotel is cleared. Um, what is this? The saloon. Loss in bullets for sure. Saloon was clear. Yes. Okay. Saloon is clear. Back. Utah! Give me two! Here we had. Nothing. Okay. Trolling with the point break. Cantaloupe with the point break. Day and Atrix, Catastrophic, Atlanta. Far Cry Tears. Denim chicken, sniping tank, ENG. I'm starting a food delivery service for zombies. It's called Hello Flesh. What up, firearms? Explodey. And then I think I got you earlier, Fid Kiss. Should probably not leave the game just like unpaused. Will Spaz, what's up? Thank you. All right, that shit's all good. Can't get into the city hall. Oh, wow, the closer, dude. That's me. I'm hitting him in his, in that, sh that right shoulder his left shoulder and I'm aiming way up so it gets wilder the the closer you get I'm not gonna use a phosphorus I'm gonna have to unless this body stays Something with, I was noticing that too earlier. Like if I stand here, I'm tired of wasting ammo trying to figure it out, but. All right, we've got, this is all clear. We couldn't get in here. This we did before. Utah! Grab the shells. Give me two. Give me two. Head back to the church. Pussy save. Smooth and by the numbers. I don't remember if I did this before, but let's do it in case it requires me to. Cubanito, I don't know. I don't. It, 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 we're in, it's definitely in the in the dumpster, but it's not not. You know, maybe like a little mask, some gloves. Oh, stab. Hold on. <laughs> okay, cool. I'll read that stab. The link got clapped, but. Okay, bank, the gold exchange. This is. Next door to bank. <laughs> oh, okay. Nash, thank you. <laughs> Radical DLC. Cowboys shoot from the hip, don't you know? This is this is a uh, form of forced immersion. It's immersion rape. Okay. I didn't consent to this immersion. We read all this. Got it. I 
need a tiny key for this. Got it. Oh, this is Anna's. This is Anna's place. I'm assuming we unlocked that door with the key we picked up earlier. Okay. Cowboys and cow moms. Drowning. Definitely a form of it. Okay. Anna's house cleared. Go back. Pussy. Fatal frame. I have uh, I have Raygon. Not the new ones, but the first couple. You're gonna be fucking immersed, you son of a bitch. Um Yeah. Love them. I have the I have the first one laying around here. I bought it because I was gonna play it. I was gonna stream it, but it, it doesn't uh The backwards compatibility to play it on the PS3 that I have was not kind to it. So, I might have to just download it. That shit's kind of cool. Even this dude's... Even this dude's trash games are kind of cool. Okay, we need a key for the sheriff's office. That's right. Um, all right. Hold on, let's dodge these. I gotta start like doing half and half. Half pistol. Half stabbing. What up, Josh Graves? How's it going? We read that earlier. This is the uh the town coffin maker. The undertaker. <coughs> A new Undertale. Oh. Another game I never played. Do two and then stab. <laughs> I could use that axe that I built. Are you related to the Jason that did the Dead Space OST? Every, every time I see you in chat, I think you did the music, Ryano. Questions for Josh Graves. Oh, Leech, what was the question? Oh, it wasn't for me. Got it. That averages out. Casket in the coffin. True. 
Yeah, I learned that watching the, uh... So that's a mandatory hit if you don't have phosphorus, which I no longer do. Okay, here's where I died last time. There's the Belfry. The heart rhythm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you fucker. Okay, well. Let's just leave. Do a little heal, go back, save. Not that beast with the resub. Coming in here, what up, beast? Uh, by the way, Josh Graves got a movie on the cusp of release, I believe. Do we have an update, Josh? We got Splendy in here, Nash, Larry, of course, and uh, Nash with the, I've been doing service in, is this a dad joke? Hold on, hold on. I have to read this. I've been doing service industry work for, tw if this is, it's incredible. For 20 plus years now, now I'm doing housekeeping for my wife. I'm truly enjoying just being alone. As an entertainer, do you find your alone time or family time more and more sacred so you don't have to be on? Also, I love entertaining, so I know it can be fulfilling, but is there an equilibrium for you? Yes, that's why I don't stream every day. Um, yeah. I feel like... There is diminishing returns for too frequent of streaming as well. It's also why if, uh, I mean, if I'm sick, I'm not going to stream, obviously. But if I'm not, if, if I'm like, I'm not even feeling entertaining, I'm not going to, I'm not going to stream because... It's different for everybody. So these rules are just for me, right? Some people some people are built different. But for me, I'm all about the final product. This is like my storefront. So my videos, this is also why I never did daily uploads. There's no way I could have done daily uploads and put the videos out that I wanted to. And it's the same with the streams. If I'm not gonna like be able to crank out something like good and entertaining and energetic, then uh, I'm not going to do it. Van Barn with the resub. What's up? Yeah, I was jonesing as well, Van. Other people, though, other people are less. Um, cause everybody's different. Here's the thing. Like, Twitch, even Twitch. Well, Twitch is mostly gaming, but even, like, YouTube gaming, right? There's so many people doing it. There did tend to be these trends that ended up being considered almost meta, right? But Twitch uh, streaming and YouTube gaming videos, that's not a genre. That's just a platform for you to do whatever you want. There's like marked differences between even people like posting Let's Plays or whatever. So I, I don't like... Uh, I don't like that a lot of people start to consider that the meta, if you're not doing whatever's meta in the moment, daily uploads or, you know, streaming, you know, however many days a week or however many hours a month or whatever, uh, you just do what you find is creating something that you're happy with. It's not a genre. It's just a platform.
And some people, some people, what they're getting out of streaming is partly the constantly being on. They're getting something out of that that I don't. Uh, but I get something out of release, releasing or presenting a uh, a product um, that they don't. So. Good content gets views. Enjoying what you do makes good content. True. But I'd be way better off if I had uploaded daily. So that it's not always... The meta is sometimes financially and algorithmically uh, advantageous. What up, Vomit Queen? Uh, I gotta figure out what to do with this. This is, uh... I hadn't thought about this situation until just now, but you get one of these ghosts out here with no phosphorus and the bodies disappeared, and I can't do anything about this. Other than sponge a hit. Maybe I can come... Before I do that, I'm going to come back. How much bath water? Sark bath water. It's just diarrhea. It's like brown oobleck. I should... <laughs> I should whip, whip that up. Buy this. <laughs> hey, guys. Bath water's for sale. Don't worry about spilling it. If the bottle breaks, it ain't going nowhere. There's some phosphorus. Nice. Go back. Let's go kill this fucker. <laughs> Got some grave dust. It's good. Our ritual is coming together. In memoriam, Miss Lee Tian Sek. Drop a save. Get this ritual going. Nice MC. Hold on, I missed the jo I missed I missed the Josh Graves. Hold on, I'm paying attention now. Josh, what's the what's the latest? <laughs> I'm picturing Josh leaning back in a leather-bound chair. It's been a challenge making it, but we've been winning awards and stuff, so definitely rewarding. What up, Violet? Yeah, it's been hard. I pulled my back at Ikea the other day. Had to go down and get some more shelves for my trophies. But, you know, we'll pull through somehow. Okay. All right. We've got candles. Bit of grave dust. I'm going to go back to Anna's house real quick, read the note. He spawned. Thanks for the nearly three years. Holy shit. MC got a new gig. Aru, Vomit Queen is in here. Schnoipen, Benji Man, 
Van Barn. I'm still keeping an eye out, Josh. Hello, Butter. Looking for advice on moving to a new state? This looks like the house of a witch. Where you know no one. Think of it like this, Butter. You can be anyone you want now. Oh, I don't need to go back. I have the notes up here. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> just nice to get some recognition. Signed a, just signed a distribution deal. Physical release is March 12th. Will be available on Amazon and all streaming platforms then. Plus Shutter release date later in the year. Okay, that's new. That's new info. We'll be sending out physical copies in the next few months for supporters that donated to crowdfunding. Okay, all right. Dude, that's awesome. Dude, the fucking three-ring circus of making your own movie and then trying to get it in front of people is just so daunting. It's just a full tilt boogie shooting it, prepping for the shoot, getting financing, all everything leading up to that. Then you cut it and you're like, ah. and it's, we've only just begun. Yeah, that's awesome. I'm glad. get in here okay note in the diary to summon the soul of a deceased person you will need fresh grave soil check church candles check personal belongings of the deceased uh, not check The place of the deceased's death, I feel like that's pretty well established. And the triple toll of the cemetery bell. Strike the bell three times. Is that what I need to do now? Let's go do it. Let's go do it. What do I think of the game so far? Uh, it's an odd mix of like, like solo dev creativity and also clunkiness but Ozzy as we've learned uh, subsequently this game was sort of a half ass attempt by the dev to raise some as far as a game made in order to raise a little capital to continue working on uh, a higher profile project Joined you in the skydiving club a couple days club a couple of days ago. Hell of an experience. Nice, Ozzy. Nice. Any particular reason, or just just to check it off the list? <laughs> Hold on, Void. We got to get you in here. Like some kind of creative little uh, in-world scares, events, effects, but also like super lame combat. Big birthday last week. Okay. Void. Get in here. Scottish bastard with the resub and butt cheeks with the dollar. Nash, my best bud, and I wrote a screenplay that was awarded a Golden Pin Award from a film festival. He's tackling all the optioning. Sounds like a damn nightmare. Here's hoping we can keep this thing moving. Nash, tap. Tap that Josh Graves ass. No, in information mine. Mine Josh Graves brain for information. That's what I mean. Or seduce, seduce him if you think you got what it takes. 
This is Hollywood, baby. Holy shit! Where's my knife? I'm fucked. Okay, that was close. I shot my gun when there was nothing in my hands, and then my hand came out and punched him. What up, Shaquille? One. Two. Let the bodies hit the floor. Okay. Three. Vicinity to place of death, place candles. Okay. All right. Got it up. Optioning is the worst headache ever. I'd rather hire a sales agent, even that's a headache. Wait, what did I? I just read somebody. Are you, who's, who's pitching Josh? Oh, Nash. A, a casting futon. <laughs> True independent filmmaking. When you're trying to fuck your stars on a futon. Probably this is Anna. Wins the Bigfoot hunt. Who knows? Who knows, Greg? Stabbing with the... Yeah, yeah. It happened because I fired the gun in... Uh, while the weapons were changing. I'm glad it didn't, like, fucking dump the game. All right, we got a good save. Decent health. Got some whiskey on the hips. We got some wild... ID donating, thank you. All right, I got candles, dirt. Passage to the farm. Call of War Res was a uh, surprisingly good game, yeah. Is this passage to the farms? Yes. Not for me yet. Sheriff's house, can't get into yet. Saloon. There's Frank's house. The mines, we have not been able to get to yet. Barn, Billy's house. Aru, oh, thank you for the bits. And Krim with the resub. What's up? Oh, it was Suds. There we go. Yeah, Streamlabs. Gotta love it. All right, let's go back. Maybe Anna's house had something of hers that I need to grab. There was the doll, but I couldn't put the doll in my inventory over here. Just got back from overseas holiday, trying to get over the sads. Uh -oh. Post-holiday blues. I don't think that is what I'm after. Okay, then we go down this. Side street takes you to the saloon.
the side of the loop. Check out his house again. What up, Glitch Man Dan? How are ya? Oh, it's the it's this is where the little box is, huh? Yes. I need to get into this shit. That'll be the last thing I need for a little ritual. Ooh, that was interesting. Can I climb him? When my girls saw you on Twitch, they mispronounced your name. You've been Mr. Shark for a while now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Ace, I agree. Decent music. Minerals and ores. Bible. Assets I don't instantly recognize, although he's recycling a lot within the game. At least it's not like the goddamn stock Unity Western shit. Let's go back down this side road and see if we can Filleting, hooking up. Sweaty palms. That's actually poetic. I made a mod. It's the tank theme in Left 4 Dead, the Serpentine Anthem. <laughs> That's sick. That's actually perfect. Oh, you must get so pumped. Tank shows up and it's like, dum, 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 dum. What up, damn jelly? We're clearing this Western town building by building now. Just asked my crush out, boys. Hopefully she never finds my Twitch username. From Oh No, I'm Hardigan. Congrats. I think that's probably valid for a lot of Twitch handles. What up, beautiful? Okay, let's do this. This is now the general store. Clear. Anything over here. Jelly, you got you got sniped by Fionix, that's right. Filleting guac, sniping Glitchman Dan. Zeppi's in here with the bits. Oh my god. Just for old time's sake, Zeppi. What did the French baker say after mowing his lawn? Time to baguette. Hope you're well, Zeppi.
Wowzer. What up, Wowzer? Right now, I don't need to go to the mines. Okay, interesting. Get to the mines through the saloon. Got it. I never saw that before. What up, chatting on? Okay, this looks pretty clear. Saloon looks pretty clear. Passage to the mines. The last airbender is. Oh, yeah. Okay, at least that doesn't hit too hard. That hit for 10. Oh, this shit is locked. What's that building? Doesn't say. around this block Let's clear it out this is aimed directly at the center of that target I'm using the reticle on my monitor it's not even hitting the I guess the bullet decals are like down here Oh, there's no ADS. Yeah, yeah. Have you looked up the new Phasmo updates? Yes. I feel like the it, it's uh, this last update's a huge step towards the game going gold. Cowboy shoots from his hip, not with your fancy schmancy reticle. That's right. So this shit is a dead end, right? There's no way to slide, sneak through here. Yeah. And the cemetery's right over there. Oh, I see. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go back. Make sure I didn't miss anything at the beginning. horses in this in Rapeville. Amir getting hooked up by Gothic? Oh shit. This all looks clear. I think that I'm probably good. What up, Cubanito? Yeah, yeah, Ram Ranch. Amaranch. 
Amaranth is still my. Still fucking makes me laugh. <laughs> Shells. Kind of worth. Empty red barrel, that's right. Save the match here. Sark lore is a bit amorphous, for sure. But if you really want, like, the hard facts, the stone cold truth, Dude, you just look up Sark on the YouTube wiki. On the Vanos and Friends group. <laughs> Unless you're Jamaican, then don't do that. Although, last I heard, I wasn't afraid of Jamaicans anymore. Questionable. Teenager? Did I read did I read Diary of a Teenager before? Well this is by the axe handle. If I write Jamaican English, will I get banned? <laughs> Gothic fleeting Cooper. We had Wowzer earlier. And also sniping. What's up, Zeppi? We got the shotgun. Reacquired the shotgun after the unfortunate death. Oh, we got to read this, though. Diary of a goddamn teenager? Hell yeah. Yesterday was my birthday. James gave me a small box as a gift so that I could keep something interesting in it. It's interesting that these kinds of boxes are not unique and can be opened with the same keys. That's why my brother made a secret compartment for me in my dresser. August 18th. Today, a local farmer visited our house. What an incredibly teenage thing to say. He and my father were discussing a woman named Anna who treats everyone in the neighborhood. For some reason, my father called her a W-I-T-C-H. I don't understand why he says that, because helping people get better is a good thing. Okay. That's why my brother made a secret compartment for me in my dresser, okay? Oh, it's this thing. Lacks a handle. I need a handle. I need a handle. If I were a teenager, where would I put the handle to my secret presser? Jazzy, why are you saying the W-I-T-C-H word? What game, are we, what game, are, uh, game is survival and horror, Hangman's Rope. Hangman's rope. Ah, this is where the axe was. I didn't grab the axe either because I thought this E was just for the, the save spot. Streamlabs quit.
I really got to get a handle on things. Okay. God, what a, what, a, what a shame if the handle doesn't spawn until you read that journal entry. You never know. Who do we got? <laughs> Fleeting. No. No. I mean, I mean, wow, we. I could time you out, I guess. What up, meds? Okay, we've looped back nearly to the beginning. Here's the train that w we unfortunately rode into town on. The Voyager. The anal Voyager. That's my uh, RV game. Here, who was asking about advice for moving to another state? While you're driving, whenever you see an RV, put anal in front of whatever the RV is called. It can be a little, it's a little road game for you. What up, Kudanaga? How's it going? It's incredible so fun. And jackpot is when you go by like an RV lot. Passed one yesterday. Yesterday called Imagine. <laughs> they have the best. It, it works every time. It's funny every time. You could probably look up RVs right now. get a bunch of good anal riffs. Rips. Riffs. Dude, I don't want the, I don't want, I don't want it to be so. I don't want the handle to have spawned because I read the note late. Just might have. Anal Explorer. <laughs> Ship names. Yeah, ships are usually more complicated. The names are more, you know, it's like rate horse racing, racing horses. Could be like more nonsensical though. Anal mountaineer, anal Colombian. Yikes. a little key to get into the treasure box. We need a handle. We need a key to the sheriff's office. We're on that key hunt. Searched all this. This is all good. What's anything out here? Let's look closely. Anal navigator. Oh, you guys like Google image searching? <laughs> Ultimate anal advantage. 
There's one called the Stealth, Anal Stealth, that I see pretty frequently. I told Jess, uh, Chilled's sweet lady, about it. And then she tweets me pictures of RVs every now and then when she find when she sees one. Anal advantage is a good one. What up, Bon? Yeah, Jess is super cool. Supply place, cleared it. It's good. Not in demo version. Am I fucked right now because of jank? Oh, there's a handle. So did I get an error message because I didn't pick up the handle? Uh, who, who knows? Whatever. Let's not read into it. Hallelujah. We got it. Progress. Bearded Viking with the resub. Uh, the handle's back. church be smart anal alacrity <laughs> oh every time i nearly crash the car every time we drive by a, like an rv lot because i'm like holy shit anal montana a anal dreaming are you guys seeing this Anal sunrise. <laughs> okay, back through the saloon. Oh, no, no, other door, other doors, other doors. the gun small is your hand enormous a little bit of both i think okay small key for some reason the the Western teen is, I only have 16 rounds, holy fuck, is carrying the key to Anna's treasure, I think is what that must be for, or the Anna's little music box, whatever. video with the prostitute pistols the hunt we were playing hunt right oh tiny pistols
Road to Prestige. Good, good times. Any COD fans excited about the Modern Warfare 3 announcement in Gamescom? What am I doing now? Anna's house. I, I mean, it. <laughs> Caffeine. I, uh, all I, I just said it's like a, uh, road trip game for me whenever I see an RV I put anal in front of whatever the name of the RV is and it makes me laugh every time and now everybody's searching RVs <laughs> although I doubt apocalypse is the name maybe maybe okay we got a personal item Nice. Let's go save. Oh, shit. Perfor performing a spirit summoning ritual. A Wait, what? This is just happening. Okay, all right. A ghostly woman appears before Richard. First set. Let's get first set up here. There you are. I have a feeling this is going to cut to credits. I don't know. I think that even as half ass as this is, nobody, I think that it's going to make me do I Because I have the gear. I think it's going to make me do the ritual. First set, get in here. Welcome. Ethan Abe. Nash, of course. I didn't see. No, I didn't see the stage rusher at Gamescom. I was having FOMO watching the Gamescom thing. I want to. I want to be there. <laughs> Copy that for a set. <laughs> All right, here we go. Performing. Oh shit. Performing a spirit summoning ritual, <clears throat> a ghostly woman appears before Richard. How? How did you manage to summon me? And why have you disturbed my spirit, mortal? The ghost asks. No way. Are we going to... You might be right, dude. Did it just do the rich... Oh, fuck. Before he can answer, Rick notices more ghosts starting to materialize around him, moving towards him. He pulls out a revolver. Just one of many. And, and you might be right, nobody. <clears throat> yeah, what's up with Rick also? You're r absolutely right, Lars. Anal Winnebago Man. <laughs> Fuck, Nash. He pulls out a revolver and aims it at one of them, then shifts the barrel towards the woman, who is stacked, by the way. God damn. Stop him. I want to help. Humans are unworthy of living. You should die and suffer like everyone else. Not a single person stood by my side in life, even though I was kind to each one of you. Please. Believe me, don't make me fucking kill you. He slowly places the revolver on the ground. Look, I mean you no harm. Listen to me, Anna. I'm just a simple train engineer. The anger on the ghost's face turns into surprise, and the undead beings begin... She, 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 killed, she killed everyone in town. She cursed, 
She cursed the entire town. Do you know my name? Anna asked. I read your diary, and I know what happened. All these people betrayed me. Why should I believe you? I found Frog's notes. I know you're innocent. What difference does it make if everyone believed that scoundrel? I'm not sure that's true. Let me look for evidence. But I need help. Oh yeah, we gotta get we gotta get to the farm, nobody. Right? There's still points of interest we haven't hit. Totally forgot. I need help. I can't get to the farms because all the passages are blocked. I'll give you a chance. The ghost waves its hands, its hands, and at the end of the street, the door of a house tears off its hinges, revealing a passage to the other side of the town. Bring me something that'll convince me, and maybe I'll lift the curse. Anna disappears. <laughs> uh, no, it's a valid expectation. Neo hooking up Ace Kitties. Two years. Ace, thank you. Neo, give East. Frutico with the bits and the dad jokes. All right, I got to get through to the farm dead ahead. Oh, be smart. I was about to. S what the fuck was going on down there? Goddamn witchcraft! Not yet, Jay Hans. I just didn't feel like playing it today. Blind prophet vibes. Dude, that was a fun. That was a fun playthrough. To the farms we go. Ooh, glitch man. Little Equilibrium reference. Phosphorus. How much is that adding? Two. Three. One each. Okay. How many matches is this? One. How many rounds is this? Three. Okay. New territory. Holy shit. Wow, that's quite a little welcoming party there. Okay. <clears throat> Have we given a timeline for this game? Like when it takes place? Um, no. O Old West. Mid-1800s. Maybe it said one in the beginning, but I forget. Nate with the resub. Um... a dead end? No, there's all kinds of shit over here. How many matches do I have? That's worth it. Okay. Um, 
We we rolled into town as a train engineer, and we've subsequently discovered that the town healer was raped by the town mayor or preacher. And then she cursed the town, and then the preacher got really mad that she got mad that she'd been defiled. And then uh, had her executed for being a witch. And we're piecing that all together as we just showed up in town here. There's a lot of mad people. Ten health. Okay. Nice. Okay. Stuck on something serious. There's the garbage. There's that garbage. Good save, though. I mean, I'm tempted to run back and save just so I don't have to pick this shit up. Mechanics of the fighting, in c if you're just joining us, it works like this. Oh, you fuckers! The gun has no reticle. It doesn't fire to the center of the screen, unfortunately. These dudes have incredible reach on their swipe. The ghosts you can't hit unless you have phosphorus that you add to your lantern, which I have two at the moment. Um, or if you shoot the body that they that they spawned out of. So, that's the mechanics. My current opinion on this game. Uh, <laughs> it's not... I'm going back to save, actually, after that. It's not as dumpstery as we've dove into, but man, you can definitely see that shortcuts were taken. What 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 game did we play Gallows at the last? At the end of the last stream, before I got sick. And it just, and it ended, and it was like, the end, crashed the credits, and then they were like, it was made, the developer is only 16, go easy. Hold on, I have it archived here.
Not, not, no, not Vertigo. <laughs> what if, though? Does the witch take her clothes off if you get her health low enough? Dude. After seeing her on that journal page? Dude, prayer hands. This game greater than the shit Muppet game. <laughs> All right, well. Agree to disagree. What was it? Haunted Hospice. That's what it was. The Haunted Hospice. Holy shit. <laughs> no, no, no. Romancelvania. I, I enjoy Romancelvania. All right. Got a fresh save. We're into the farms. Welcoming party's been dispatched. I need to find evidence to prove. Who do I have? Okay. I can spin few rounds of her. We gotta prove to Anna that the town's not all bad. Even though... Get out the knife. Get out the knife. It's close. Almost ran out of phosphorus. I'm trying not to waste ammo. So I can't hit... Those, those enemies, if they spawn in like that, I can't hit them unless I have phosphorus and I can turn the lantern green. Pike. Okay. Real cowboy shoot from the hip, partner. Akiba's trip, Arlo. Um, uh, ooh, we got a handy save point. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's play smart. I've never even heard of this. I'll check it. I don't, dude, I'm not, I'm not averse to, uh, anime shit. I think the real, I think the real, like, negative connotation of being a weeb comes from blindly supporting anything with an anime aesthetic. Because, dude... Japan is cranking that shit out. I think we've talked about anime in here before, right? I, th I, in my opinion, most anime is dog shit. But when it's good, it's fucking primo. Can I get up here? Okay. Going on back here. I mean, they're just cranking it out. Okay. It's actually impressive. Uh, well, kind of. No, it's impressive. Even if the animation quality on a lot of it is just garbage, but... <laughs> Arctic? I heard anime. I love, I love good anime.
what is a what's a good example of anime? Ooh. Anime that well, anime that I like. Um, well, we j when we talked about this last, I had just watched Redline. I thought Redline was incredible. Um, what did I watch that I didn't like? Um, I stalled out watching Attack on Titan. I thought the action in it was so cool, but everything in between was so, like, fucking melodramatic. I'm going to go back and finish it, though. But. Because I do, I do want to know how it plays out, but. Does Mrs. Sark watch all? No, Bond, no. She would like boy. Well, no, actually, sh boiling point might stress her out. Actually, I hope I can get back through here. I like. I think that that uh, that director of Redline's visuals are fucking killer. I like. Didn't he do the uh, the sprinter in Animatrix? well maybe I'm thinking of the wrong guy I don't know have I watched Pokemon oh my god okay dude now this this is where I might like piss some people off I've already done this before we've covered it on in here but fucking Pokemon is trash it's f it's so bad it's so poorly written it's so poorly animated and it kills me that my kids love it. And I say a lot of the same shit about po Pokemon that I do about Minecraft. What a fucking waste. What a waste. What have these things become? Minecraft is fucking garbage now. Oh, it's so heartbreaking. <laughs> fucking Pokemon. Pokemon... Po the idea, the root of Pokemon is like the most brilliant, coolest shit ever. Like, and obviously they print money, but the shows fucking suck. And the games, the games are an insult. If you like Pokemon, dude, these games are fucking garbage. <laughs> They're so bad. They didn't, they weren't always, but they are now. And it's, it's. It's like, and my, and Aurora loves it. And she's like, dude, play Pokemon with me. And I do it. I'll read, I'll like, I read all the fucking text boxes and everything. And it's like, fuck, dude, this is painful. The earlier stuff was like mark, markedly better. But the games, especially, I'm talking about the games, especially. The show, yes. The show is fucking lame. But the games are so... They're so, like, half-assed. Same take on COD. Dude, dude, th the annual COD release, polish-wise, dwarfs what they're putting out in Pokemon. Aurora will even, she'll even listen to me read this and she'll be like, uh, she's like, we're going to do all these quests because, um, I want to get the rewards. But she's like, it does sound like it was written for kids younger than me. She's seven, though. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, it does sound like that. It does sound like this is some fucking baby shit. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, suddenly it's we throw down. Okay. And I'm not trying to just fucking roast it. Because oh, that's bullshit. I I I like the I like the concept. I, and I wish it was better. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Because I'm down to five fucking rounds. I know, I'm just old. Old man yells at children's property. Whatever. Who, who, the, who the fuck knows, dude? Don't listen to me. I say this. I'll say it too about YouTube strats, dude. Don't take YouTube advice from me. There's people out there printing money that don't do. Uh... <coughs> that don't do what I was doing. It's true. I, kids shit does not have to be dumb. I, I definitely agree with that, but. This seems like crime. What the f This is life without the lantern? Oh no, it's because we're in like. Uh, What up, Lucky? Uh, almost out of bullets. Mayday. Mayday. Get this lit. Holy shit. Snake case. That guy's going to my plane. Honeybee. Um, I think COD is is definitely... I mean, if you're having to... I, th I think COD needs to be once every three years. I think it should be. Every other year. Maybe. I mean, but that would never... Once again, that's not how you print money. Pokemon's printing money. COD's printing money. I'm the one who, like, YouTubed, like, once every week and a half. Don't listen to me. If your goal is to make some cash, if your goal is to turn out a good product, maybe reel it in. So, yeah. I won't say exactly the same thing, Honeybee, but COD's definitely, like, it's just too, too little butter, not enough toast. Yeah? Yeah? Something like that. Madden NBA games. I get why there's annual installments of those. Just purely for the, the like, I mean, you could update rosters, though. As you could, you could do that online. Maybe save, like, the big, big jumps. I feel like they feel forced with Matt with sports games. I feel like they feel forced to to do like some type of technological leap when they don't have to. All people want is the new teams and then keep the game running smooth and uh, have it look good. But every year they've got to be like, fuck, dude, it's another year. We got to get everybody new in the game. And, and what are we going to announce what are we gonna do? Are we gonna what new mode are we gonna announce that will bring people in? It's like, dude, just make it run nice. Then you get all these like weird bells and whistles. Not to mention like all of the microtransaction hell that sport sports video games have become. If if they just released. If, again, put it on a three-year cycle. If you made, like, a big tech leap every three years for Madden and all the in-between years, were, it was basically just bug-stomping and 
roster updates, I honestly think people who play Madden would be completely fine with that. You don't need, like, a new fucking... Dude, live the life of your favorite NFL star off the field. Oh, no, paparazzi's caught him at it again. Press X to fucking shield your face as you leave the restaurant or whatever. It's like, fuck, dude, nobody gives a shit. <clears throat> whatever. Uh, I bought a full barn of explosives. <laughs> Je June 12th, now I'll be able to prepare the land for planting crops and clear away those rocks. August 18th. Yesterday, Father Frog gathered all the people in the main square of our town and accused our local witch of causing the drought. Frog's an influential person in the town. All the local gangs obey him. Not many people know about it, but many suspect it. The next day I met him and he threatened my family to make me commit a crime. He insisted <laughs> he, he insisted that I falsify the voting results in Addis Hanging Case. Press X to hang a witch. Despite my initial hesitation, I eventually agreed to his proposal because the lives of my loved ones are more important to me. <laughs> Otter. <laughs> this is like the, the what's that dude? Life size of the rich and famous. August August twenty second. Seventies <laughs> news anchor. Robin Leach. Thank you, Quasi. What are you doing sit what are you doing sitting out there in in non subland? Get in here. It's cold out there. August twenty second <laughs> Emma suddenly ran up to me out of breath and said Pokemon's written for babies. Uh I told her to shut up because she's going crazy. I'm not going anywhere. I'm gonna fucking get a sh shiny Snorlax and fuck beat my meat until I black out. In anger, she packed her things and ran out, slamming the door behind her. Well, damn you, I shouted after her. <laughs> Oh shit. Okay. All right. Where where was I? When I was sitting alone in my house <laughs> grinding to get every evolution of Eevee, I heard a knock on the door. My heart raced when I recognized the sheriff's voice. It's cuz this vo <laughs> what I'm reading in this voice <laughs> it doesn't line up at all. My heart raced when I recognized the sheriff's voice. What a dream boat. The next thing I remember, I was standing over his lifeless body. Wait, what? Sitting... What the fuck is happening? Don't know who Emma is. Warning about... Don't let Anna get... Get hanged. Okay. Um... Then this dude, suddenly, this dude who was like, no, I can't do this, but I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid for my family because Frank and Frank and the gangs are going to fucking kill me if I don't vote. But now, so he finally, he reluctantly votes. And then later when, this is later, right? This is four days later. So Frank's not even here right now. Emma, I'm presuming that's like wife or daughter, runs up and it's like, no, you can't let this happen to Anna. And then this dude's like, shut up. You're crazy. I'm not going anywhere. Like, what? Okay. Then she packs her shit, bails. Fuck you. I'm all about hanging the witch now. When I was sitting alone in my house, 
heard a knock on the door. My heart raced. Next thing I remember, I was standing over his lifeless body. He was questioning me about Franck and the details of our conversation. I was afraid he would expose our plan. I just wanted to save my family. No, bullshit. You didn't confide in your wife at all. You told her she was going nuts and to fuck off. <laughs> then she left, you fucking asshat. Um, I just wanted to save my family. I rummaged through James's pockets. Also, killed a cop. Wow, we found the key to the plot and tampered. Good, because I've lost it. Tampered with the voting results. Uh, I did everything, Frank, but I can't live with this burden. Totally realistic behavior. Coming in from the fucking young, the young man. What up, Aru? Emma's the girl. Well, yeah, but I mean, she packed her shit, so I'm assuming that Emma is this dude's lady. All right, does that count as proof? I mean, that seems like proof to me. Billy, that's Billy. Uh, I don't want to go out here anymore because I'm out of bullets. Also, I want to save. Is there a radio or some shit in here? No. Okay. Billy's house, barn, passage to the farms. Uh, okay. Can I get back to a safe? Still open? No. And a fucking empty text error message. <laughs> okay. Alright, we gotta go to the bar. Worth a match. Okay, all right. What up, Vitus? music. Dynamite. You can blow something up. Okay. <laughs> Whatever, man. I feel like you've killed 20 people. Yeah, hopefully, uh, Hopefully, as part of the curse being lifted on this town, ev all the zombies I've murdered uh, also come back to life. This house is clear. Is that 
open now. Oh shit, who's coming in here? Grave? Here we go. Ass or tits? Yes, Big Daddy. What up, Grave? What were you up to? Getting up to no good over there? What were you playing? Last Corona? Oh shit, okay. No pressure though. That door, negative. This. The Mormon Church's official. Did I just. Oh, I right clicked to get out of my alt tab. Fuck, well, there goes the phosphorus. Mormon Church's official stance on this game. Um. The official stance is that through modern revelation, many of the beliefs that the church held during this challenging time have changed and evolved. Okay. Polygamy. Polygamy was... It, it was a necessity back then, you know? What up, Atreyu? You know what? I remember one of the things... Um, that, that I'd been... That I was told early on was... Uh, so many of the men in the church had been killed because of persecution. True. True. Um, that they needed to have multiple, the remaining men needed to have multiple wives just so the families could be supported. Shit, can I blow this up? This is fucking prime blow up or shit. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I don't think I'm getting any interaction. I think, obviously, polygamy is illegal now, but you, you can still RP that shit. I think they should RP polygamy. Hashtag open RP. With the power of your imagination, you can be married to as many people as you want. Hashtag open RP. Polygamy LARP in my apartment this weekend. <laughs> that has to have been done. Oh, can I blow these open now? Is that what this is all about? Dude, let me blow something. that just a harem? It's whatever you pretend, what, it's whatever you imagine it to be. Wow, you do not want to run out of uh, matches in this part of the map. What? You 
I open those? Hey Zeus, Aurora, yeah, Aurora got, s only Aurora and I got sick. But she's doing better, hey Zeus. is where I got the dynamite. Here's Anna's hanging body. I mean, it's gotta be up here, right? Or, or, game sucks, and I just can't progress. Also, distinct possibility. Yeah, it doesn't matter how good the music track is if uh, I should be careful, because I can sock lock. Explore that. I, 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 dude, there's so much of this shit. I could fucking get in there, dude. Nope, don't do it. Don't do it. Wait, what's the, uh, what's the belief? Mormon tried to hit on my mom how she'd live on his planet after death. Got confused when she asked whether she gets her own planet if she doesn't marry him. <laughs> I mean, that that is the end game. Greg knows. If you could, if you could hide to Kolob. As God is, uh, how did how does it go? As as man is, God once was. As God is, man can be. Something like that. Someday you can have your own little gaggle of saviors running around. Clear this house real quick. It was here, this safe. Hopefully, I'm clear. Okay, all right. We got the sheriff's key. Nice. Moving right along. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. The sheriff's key, we gotta go back through to the main town area. Can you get more TNT? I doubt it. Might as well try, though, Quasi. Kumbacha, kombucha, kombu... Fuck it. High protein. Thanks for the prime. 
support us with the reset Buddha food. Suds hooking up a tray you. We got Big Daddy in here, Grave Embrace in here. Cole, Poke Fluter, Lucky. No, no, no. I mean, why couldn't I though, really? You know? It doesn't seem like there's a shortage of boom boom. Honeybee, Mitch Talica earlier, Attributey, Listless, Breaking Noses. Hold on, I missed a few people back here. Thomas to the fourth power, Cormaic, and Nate. What's up? Here we go. On to the next. So far, the internet. I mean, of uh, a internet, a as hey, eld hey, up a ints say of a rash hey. What's this? Is there a save point? Warehouse, Anna's, there's the church. Okay, so that's closest. Here we go. Hope the gun jams. Oh my god, if gun if gun jamming becomes a thing. I'm in trouble. Madam Sark. Adam Sark's gonna live on uh, a planet orbiting Kolob with me one day. It's gonna be so nice. What the fuck am I doing? Oh, sheriffs. Shit, okay. Greg, soon to be father, looking for some advice. Adam Sark. Good old Greg is also a, uh, a Mormon, uh, a Jack Mormon. All right, Sheriff. Okay. Nash. When I was a child, my dad and I were both really sick. That was the first time I saw aliens. I was six. My dad and I always watched movies when we were sick. Do you have a thing you do when you and your kids are sick together? We fucking play Pokemon. <laughs> you watched you watched aliens? Fuck. I, I got a little rushed on the, the last, like, hour and definitely was not stabbing everyone that I could have been. And it's feeling like now it really wanted me to save all my ammo for this shit. Maybe, maybe it's just avoid them.
take part in soaking and or being a jump man? Oh, soaking. No, I've never known anybody that actually did it. But would I put it past the Rick's BYU crowd? Negative. I need to do a little of this. <laughs> Greg. I'm five minutes from BYU. I can... The, the, the Richter scale's shaking right now. Okay, full health. We gotta get to that building. I wonder... Okay, 90 health. I wonder if I can stab these fuckers. Okay, 80 health. Okay, 45 health. You know what? We're gonna shotgun. We got a shotgun. Everyone thinks we're on a f the Utah, yeah, the Salt Lake fault line. No, it's just all the jump men helping out their soakers. Virtual Bilbao with the resub. Eldritch with the advice: Don't shake the baby too much, Greg. to assert dominance. Good advice. Running low on ammo here. All right, people. It's probably one shell. Today was an unusual day. The priest's assistant came to my office and informed me that Frank was gathering all the townspeople in the square for an urgent announcement. When I arrived at the square, I heard him accusing a woman who is very dear to me of witchcraft. I noticed people starting to support him. Not wanting them to jump to hasty conclusions, I decided to step forward and say that we should first gather the voices of all the townspeople before making a final decision. I was confident that Frank's accusation were unfounded, was unfounded, were accusations were unfounded, and I didn't want Anna to become an innocent victim. I've known her for a long time, and we have a close relationship. I often help her and fuck her, but now I must uncover the truth while suppressing my overwhelming emotions and feelings, because if Frank really assaulted her... <laughs> I'm afraid I'll have to send. Once everyone dispersed, I went to Anna to find out why the priest was against her. She told me he'd assaulted her a few days ago. This is a serious accusation against a clergyman. Nevertheless, I promised her protection until I get to the bottom of this. Oh. <laughs> August 18th. Today, I started collecting signatures from the townspeople. Most of the people I approached were against executing Anna. Thank God. 
However, there were a few who believed she was guilty. August 19th. Yesterday, I managed, I managed to gather the townspeople's signatures. The majority were against the execution. In the evening, I went to the bar to relax and unwind. To my surprise, Russell approached me and said that Frank, Frank, Frank and Billy Biley were sitting behind the bar discussing something about the vote. It seemed suspicious to me. I'll need to visit Biley's farm. Wow. What a chad. Who do we got here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Falcones. <laughs> okay. I got some shells and some intel. That's it. Got to go to the farm. assume it's open now. Saloon had passage to... No, that was to the mines. Oh, I have access to the farm. Well, what the fuck are we doing here? Sheriff? Did that just... <laughs> that ghost just whispered, fuck me, I think. What up, Slim? Oh, I never got the... Gr Wait a minute. Uh, wow, that's random. That ghost was like, fuck me. <laughs> fuck me. I was like, huh? <laughs> New Resident Evil goose. It does have, uh... I'm in here. Yes, I've been here. Okay. Okay. Look at this little, like, Chinese. Dude, they sell cocaine? Give me over to the... Take me to the cocaine shop. I'm telling you, Old West Medicine was the shit. Oh! Oh, shit! In the... Oh, wait. Nobody. Is this it? Is this the crash to credits? In the somber atmosphere, steeped in the spirits of the past. Richard, the train engineer whose train derailed in this town not one hour ago, tremulously, tremulously stood before the ghostly entity. He carried with him records capable of changing the course of fate. Diaries of the townspeople in a document lay before Anna. I always thought he betrayed me. 
Anna whisper. Oh. Uh, wow, I thought he betrayed me. Anna whispered, breaking the silence. He did. He, he, he didn't come to. Uh, we still was. He didn't come to say goodbye to me on the day of my execution. I felt hurt and betrayed. But now, after reading their accounts, I realize it was different. Then he tried to help me and protect me from an inevitable fate. What have I done with my reckless actions? Uh, I'll tell you how to remove the spell from the city. She's definitely not supposed to be whispering anymore. <clears throat> to start, take retribution and kill the souls of those who voted for my death. You'll see the evil in their eyes. Then go to the mines, dig and burn skeleton. That's not a complete sentence. <laughs> Count seven steps from the exit of the mine and dig. But be careful. Be careful, mortal. Wow, feels very conspiratorial. What, not now what? <laughs> Aru with the bits, yes! <laughs> Hold on. Then we got Falcone's earlier. The diehard impression with a British jerk. Who said anything about be a terrorist. <laughs> uh, okay, to the mines. The mines via saloon. But first, church and save. I have nine bullets, 17 shells. but I have a heart full of positivity. Blindly found that shovel. Uh, where are you? Okay. Okay, quick, there's a saloon. Saloon was back here. Got it. What up, Grip? Yeah, feeling much better. Feeling much better. Uh, the stream uh, dipped service to Switchboard dipped earlier. So the stream went down, came back. But we've been going. Yeah, we're like four and a half hours in. The mining town from Paint Your Wagon Lock. Holy shit. That's a reference. <laughs> you look like shit. <laughs> Glad you feel. Does your face hurt? You should have done. Yet. Does your face hurt? Oh, that ghost just zipped through there. Uh, saloon is over there. Okay. Uh, let's get this. Paint your wagon and come along. That's a bizarre movie. Okay, progress? Yes, progress, okay. Heals, ammo, ammo, save. Nope, 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 nope. Grab, grab. 
save. Okay. <clears throat> I don't think it's that long. Maybe there's an edit of it that long. Um. Maybe it is. Maybe I'm just... That's fucking bullshit. Um, how do I want to do this? Got it. Perspective of the the game is uh, it's not helping that the hand model is huge and the gun seems tiny. Yeah, paint your wagon is uh, a western musical where Clint Eastwood sang all his own parts. And to be honest, he wasn't terrible, but it wasn't. Great, either. <laughs> I think Lee Marvin's in it. He kills it. Mossy with the resub. You might be right. It might just be a fun Titanic movie. Okay, there's the tail end of my my train. I'm like Kurt Russell in Big Trouble in Little China, I'm trying to get back to my fucking truck. Just keep moving. this side of things here. Big Trouble in Little China musical. Yeah. I mean, that movie feels like a musical, and it's not. Aru, looking up SW. Whiskey. Fresh save. Here we go. Slices. Yeah. It'll be fine. Just tedious. <laughs> this music is so dramatic.
Go back. Oh. I'm with you, Ace. Surprisingly good. Even if it did start to loop a little. Did I, did I wing the jukebox? <laughs> yeah, there's not much of a mind there. Why? What's going on, Arctic? The Jamaican music. It does feel a little like that, Locke. Um, okay. Oh, I've got to dig while I'm here. Spaz with the resub. Cursed is still up, Carrie. Yeah. Uh, ranch. Oh. oh my god, I think they're just infinite. I wouldn't have been shooting all of them if I knew that there was unlimited. Wait a minute. I need I need a I can't get in there though. Uh this game Rancho, this game is called what's the full name? Survival and Horror, Hangman's Rope. Hangman's Rope. Is 
this the hide and seek for the interact point here? Finding prop hunts. Don't, don't. Oh, okay. I like this. Oh, we got a fresh save just in case. Nope. Oh, oh, free? Free? Okay. Anything to interact with here? have a fresh save. Oh, is that as far as I can go? No! No! I'm pretty. What up, Ryries? I think I'm pretty out of bounds here. Any good intel? a random little path. Quick, sprinkle phosphorus up your ass. Uh, caveman, that would be a good one, actually. Near the mine, half of a skeleton is buried. Burn the bones. Count seven steps from the mine's entrance. Okay. I mean, well, what the fuck? Yes, progress. After an incident at work today, I'm worried I'll not fit in after feeling confident that I do. Oh, Arctic. Okay. I got you. We're still on this game, Gothic. I think we're uh, making progress. <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't know what to say about that, Arctic. That sounds like a wild incident. After overcoming numerous obstacles, Richard manages to unearth a skeleton. He picks up an oil lamp from a nearby structure, pours the bones with oil, sets them on fire, Flames burst forth, and the spirits howl malevolently. Holy shit, dude. We're badass. Explanation for the stream title. Oh, because we're playing potentially shitty games, Goose. So you need a hazmat suit. We're also playing potentially flickery flashy games so the epilepsers will freak out fleeting thank you for the bits real lucky richard learned all this shit in train train engineering school yeah yeah that the uh what was the name of the train the dreamboat or some shit 
hires like straight up man with no name gunfighters. What up, Spaz? Thank you for the bits. Uh, hope you feel better about shit, Arctic. Hope you come around. Then the ghosts began to vanish, the fog dissipated, and James heard the morning bird song. Is this our crash to credits? The curse of the city's been lifted, and souls will find peace. No longer does this place pose a threat to people, and in time it will be inhabited once again. Wow. This story will turn into a legend, just as the residents of this city turn to dust. I'm going to die here because there's nothing to eat or drink. And my train's derailed. Who derailed my train, by the way? P.S. Thank you for playing. Survival and horror game series serves as support for the main activities of Honor Games. The money earned from these projects is invested in the development of the company's main games. Vladimir and Alexandra. And there it is. Man, there's good, there's good parts, and then there's not. Stars! 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 What? And BTS? 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 Anal snow piercing. Okay, hold on. Let me get some corn out there for Darth. <laughs> Devil, dude. I can't tell you how much money I've sent into Russia, and God only knows how much Bitcoin I've mined for them. I'm like a bullet point on China's like f yearly financial meeting. Aru, what up, Forge? Aru, thank you. And Forge Templar. Here we go. Feed my fellow Sith Lord. Darth Maul Dad in here. The Darths uniting. Darth, hope you're rocking and rolling. Thank you. Darth snipe, Darth sniping Darth. We've got Darth on Darth violence happening. Young Link. Doing some late night editing. Run it back, New Game Plus. That was an option, huh? Yeah, Carrie, it was. It had... You can tell that these, uh, these devs... Like, know what the fuck they're doing. Okay, this is the next installment in the survival and horror franchise. Keep in mind, I did not know until someone in chat, I forget who we were chatting with earlier, pointed out that these are the uh, folks behind Eternal Evil. We played that game for a while. Um, hold on. Sake. I need your help. This was Eternal you Evil. Know. Some of you may remember. I haven't encountered anything like this before. Bravo 7, Bravo 7, Psycho Bravo Gorman. Do you copy? I'm gonna have to watch it. I don't think I've ever seen it. Hotel, and be careful. It's very dangerous in the forest. We barely made it out alive. 
the heck is going on? Three days ago, the earth shook. Giant spikes emerged from the ground all over the city. People started turning into bloodthirsty. This demons. game was way more robust. They attacking those who so apparently, what we've learned. I'm a scientist, Jacob Willis. I think it has something to do with the water. Can I come with you? It's even more dangerous around me. Psycho Gorman, why have I house. never? Hold on. With Rich Evans, actually, it's actually Rich Evans in there. I've never even heard of this movie. Huh. Anyway, this is Eternal Evil. We played this. These devs have started. What up, Nick? What up, Raiders? Nick, hope you had a good stream. That was the Hank fucking game. Yeah, yeah. So these devs have been churning out these bite size games. To fund, allegedly. Um... Eternal Evil 2. Top 0.00001% Texas Chainsaw player in the house. Nick, do you like... I heard it's... Uh, maybe this was like early get good game media loser reviews, but I heard it's... Uh, balanced in favor of killers. Is that... Would you back that up? When you play, do you want to be killer or sur it definitely is okay all right all right so this is survival and horror mortanus prisoners a survival horror game set in a third reich concentration camp so these are just these are these are not related games. This is what I was talking about earlier. I like I kind of like the idea of like an anthology series like this, but I play victim, but it's fun when you get to escape. I would say I escape one, one and three. Okay. Um, set in a third right concentration camp where the camp's leadership upon discovering a planned rebellion orders the execution of all accomplices main prota main protagonist encounter an even more terrifying fate will they be able to escape the nightmare here we go last of faith off the plane nice Okay, we've got our setup. Let's go. Light little story. 1944, June 17th. Concentration camp office. Oh. A girl named Justina was working at her desk. While the war raged outside the camp walls, she found herself in the heart of evil, hiding behind her ordinary position. Oh, what up? Augie! Your husband can't avoid you in here. Hold on, hold on. How do I regain high, lustful eyes? <laughs> Nick, you know. Okay, Augie, okay, 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 Augie, Augie. All right, all right. Okay. <laughs> all right, you have your husband's attention right now. Okay, anyway, where, where were we? Oh yeah, death camp office. <laughs> Suddenly, three Germans approached her desk. An officer, accompanied by two soldiers, stood before her with a stern expression. We know everything, Justina, the officer said in a harsh voice. We know that you are a member of the underground partisan movement. Justina felt her heart racing, her palms sweating, and tears welling up in her eyes.
for your treacherous activities, you are sentenced to death, the officer continued. You will be subjecting, subjected to medical experiments, and you won't like it. Despite her fear, Justina refused to show her weakness to them. She met the officer's gaze with courage and said, I will not regret my actions. If they bring even a little justice, she's American, I am willing to sacrifice myself. That way I don't have to do the accent as much. For a, for a moment, a perplexing mix of respect and disdain appeared in the officer's eyes. But within seconds, he ordered her to be seized and taken away. Also, hey, what the fuck are you doing? What are you doing right now? Are you reading an M.G. Gallows Alex Foster joint? Because if you're not, you're wasting your fucking life. Throwing it right down the old toilet. There it goes. Hey, check out M.G. Gallows. And if you have any questions for the author of the Alex Foster Necromancer as Fuck series, he's in chat right now. Give him a little ringy-dingy. Ask him some questions. Hit him up. Read a book for once in your life, you fucking pathetic loser. Okay. Oh, shit. We're still going. Some time passed. And Justina woke up in a dark, cold place. <laughs> if only, if commercials were all that aggressive, God, TV would be so much better. She, she felt cramped, sensing a slight draft coming from above her head. She reached out and opened a small door. Justina began crawling out. Justina, by the way, the most American name of all time. Where's the beef, you fucking idiot? <laughs> Built Ford tough. Unlike you, you pussy. Dude, just apply it to every commercial. It would be, it would just, TV would be so entertaining. Okay, all right. Justina began crawling out and upon emerging, realized she'd been lying in one of the chambers of the morgue. The room was cold and dimly lit, permeated with the smell of death and fear. Justina sensed an eerie presence as Mortanus, a creature resembling death itself, suddenly emerged from the shadows. A skeletal figure, draped in a cloak, towered before her. Oh, wait. That's just Hutch in the morning, emanating a chilling cold that penetrated her very being. Oh, oh shit, okay. You are dead, Justina. Mortanus uttered in a low voice. And here in this afterlife realm, your friends await you. What? Where, where am I? And what friends are you talking about? She asked, hoping it was all a false dream or some kind of illusion. <laughs> after, a, after a slight mockery, Mortanus replied, Your friends are those people whom you condemn to death for their refusal to join the Protestant forces. You were an instrument in their execution, and now they have returned to meet you once again. With those words, Mortanus vanished, leaving Justina in a dead silence. <laughs> College? Okay, hold on. Quick slots, flashlight. Important documents are marked with the title quest related to all other entries in the game. See, there's little things that just show these are some s savvy devs. Uh, 
to be honest, the anime community can be very tribalistic. That's why I hang here where I can speak freely. Plus, I sort of had fun heckling you. If this were a VTuber community, I'd be immediately tarred and feathered. Oh, I, don't, I got nothing against VTubers. I, I also l like anime. What up, what? Welcome aboard. Yeah, the stream crashed earlier, but we're at like, I'm at five hours, ten minutes at the moment. Scornful with the resub, Obsidianini with the dot polis, polisini, Nick with the raid, of course. Oh, fleeting with the bits and the eternal evil nod. Hold on. Is this? Here's hate. I have hate. Oh, oh, here we go. Okay. Let's check it out. Fleeting's got the links for us. Here's hate. I have hate. I fought What? He took everything from me. He killed my daughter. He's responsible for all this. Here's hate. Hey. Interesting. Apologies for that. I don't know. I don't know what that clip was all about, Fleeting. I fucked hey. Like, dude. Mom! Dad, get off the phone! Or mom. Okay, so what do we got here? <laughs> Nick. <laughs> Me, if I was in Breaking Bad. I am the one who fucks. Mortanus Prisoners. Here we go. Mortanus Prisoners number one. Uh, this is fucking dark. Oh, I do have a lot. Of okay, all right. Got a little. Wait, is that shit I can grab? Guess not. What's this? Save spot? Okay. Alright! So we just. Like, we just woke up in a. Uh, A death camp basement. And we talked to the Grim Reaper. Okay. Like, uh, off we go. Morgue office. Morgue. Wow. I thought, I thought my bathroom decoration was bad in Outlast. Holy shit. They've got me beat. Just floor to ceiling micro tiles. Oh shit. Here we go. We got some lore. I can no longer continue this. There's no point in resisting. No hope of salvation. My strength has been depleted and my soul is filled with endless despair. My daughters asked me to play Pokemon with her again. Fucking kill me. No, w wait. In this accursed camp, I've lost everything that was important to me. My family, my dreams, my hope. All vanished, shattered by the merciless machinery of death and suffering. I hear the screams at night when darkness engulfs this nightmarish world. The screams of those who still resist, but I can no longer. I have surrendered. I will defeat the final gym boss for Aurora because I must. I am her father. 
Oh wait, my life has become nothing but a shadow of itself, and my soul is burdened with the weight of sins and shame. I live each day hoping that the end will come soon, that this torment will be over. Until the next game comes out. A lot of off-script voice acting in this game. Pet peeve of mine when the voice acting doesn't match the subtitles. He looks dead. <laughs> Don't throw out your spine. My sciatica! Locked from the other side. Need power. Okay, I'm gonna have to... Place some shit. Got it. Two keys and some electrical shit. So far, morgue, office, morgue. Several bodies covered with fabric. Fleeting, you piecing out? Headphones are dying, have a good night. Thanks for hanging out, dude. <laughs> gotcha, at the buzzer. You're out of here. <laughs> Spaniardy, thanks for the resub. Witcher for hire, love you fleeting. Strange figurine of a broken angel. How strange. How broken. Can't do anything with it. What do we got here? A Luger? Key to the morgue. Wow, we and and a parting wow, we ni hao. That one's for you. I couldn't even reply to all the good nights. In a way, you're welcome. Spaniardy, thanks for that tier two, and you hit the three years, Spaniardy. Sputnik sandwiches, Witcher, also hitting three years. Simultaneously is Witcher. Thank you. Rifkin. I think I missed you earlier, Rifkin. God damn it. What up, dude? He meant to say Wowzers. Oh, is Wowzers the... Okay, all right. Wait, your team Wowee, right, Nihau? Or no? Or do I have my Wows crossed? the office. Ooh, let's do this. Be smart. Respect the game. Working from home today. Okay, copy that. Rifkin. Knee housers. Why w w Okay. Alright, as a mnemonic device... Can I just say, that one sucks balls. Because it could also be Nihawi. This is it going to help me? Zero. <laughs> Nih I'm just going to have to remember memorize it. Nihausers. Fuck. Okay. Listen, listen to the little tippy tap. <laughs> Tornado, yeah. Various medical instruments. Oh my god.
Who is Nihao anyway? Wow, now we know what happened to Dornado. The answer to what happened to Dornado is that he just started asking what happened to everybody else. Pistol bullets. What do we got? Admin key. I'm assuming that's... I mean, it really feels like shit's gone sideways here at the old death camp. should have known I should have known I don't know if it's good news or bad news that Rifkin's working at home oh shit does this gun actually shoot where you aim that's so much better by the way I still have my monitor monitor radical on what if I push right mouse oh I can aim I'm turning it off hold on okay strange small and heavy and heavy safe What is going on? Strange statuette in the form of a man. <laughs> is that tornado with like intestine, infinite intestinal loop? Hold on. I, I think while I'm in this load zone here. What up, Jimmy Tron? Jimmy Tron? Jimmy Tron? It's over here. And German Lover? Oh, so that was not the morgue office key. Get back there and you grab my intestines, young man. That was like the uh, the sumo wrestler in the story of Rikio who gets his stomach punched out. Lock is broken. Okay. They gave me some I'm on some wild Nazi drugs here. No, college, every time I've looked at the window, the reaction's the same. It's like, oh my, oh my god. 
Okay. So the basement is fucked. How are we looking up here? Danger. Ipsumia within. Hey, July 27th, 1944. The intense situation on the front forces. On the, fr on the front forces. Take two. The intense situation on the front forces us to acquire human resources from wherever possible. Our camp is no exception, and the number of guards is steadily decreasing, approaching a critical level. The prisoners are unaware of the current situation outside the camp, but I believe that sooner or later they will notice the dwindling number of guards and the fact that some soldiers are pulling double shifts. All we can do is not show any signs of weakness and vulnerability. I suspect that among the prisoners there are many partisans, and the recent uprising demonstrated that they are capa capable of overpowering us if we show any signs of weakness. Okay, how does this go from... Uh, like, we have to escape. It's Steve McQueen. We have to escape the camp. To... It's a flesh wall outside the window. And there's intestinal, intestine loopy. You know? That's the question. I'm excited to see where the, where the game takes us. Save one inventory spot here. No map. Files. Items. a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> the walls outside look like if you took a microscope to APL's bed sheets. <laughs> or the seat of his chair. I wonder, actually, I wonder if. Fuck, next time, next time at, I'm at L APL's place, I'm going to smell his chair. I want to do it. I'm going to do it. I just want to get the experience. I want to, I want to experience, you know. Like what what could the odor be? Just shit? <laughs> if it's just if it's just shit, that's it's fucking nothing. What up, J King? Bam Gaming with the resub. God Haver. Jibitron, Rifkin, German Lover. Here we go. And then Obsidianini going into Lurk mode. It's going to be weird. It's going to be weird, Obsidianini. You're going to have awful dreams. Oh, shit. This camp is turning into a real lab laboratory of death. Experiments are conducted here that make my hair stand on end. I've seen them studying the effectiveness of various torture methods. Mm-hmm. 
They experiment with our endurance, pushing the limits of our pain. Every scream and moan becomes a note in this horrifying symphony, symphony they compose. I hate them for what they do to us, but I won't let them break me. I won't give them the satisfaction of seeing me not complete Pokemon Violet. I will preserve my strength and dignity until the very end. Fucking weird. Key to the need the key to the main door of administration. Okay. All right. I wonder if I used my admin key getting in here. Get up, Insidious. Bullshit. Okay. Mirror layers was great, Bard. Yeah. Oh, EDS is so nice. J. King, feeling a lot better. Still a little, uh, <clears throat> the t I'm on the very tail end of it. Energy levels are back, though, but still clearing it out a bit. I can tell the voice is still a little, uh, strained. finding lots of pistol ammo. That would make me happy. Listening to the stream like a podcast, but I can tell when Sark reads a note because of his change in tone. <laughs> no. Fully voice acted video game. And I appreciate that. What, what the fuck is this shit? Wait, wait, we go from this room. Dude, what happened to Dornado? We go from this room to this. A strange mechanism similar to scales. A number is highlighted on the scale. Five. What the fuck? Locked up by some mechanism. Okay. So all of a sudden, a Gmod map. outside now I don't need that okay. that's a little potentially a little AGBS here just furniture what do we got here oh shit more v more fully voiced what the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me? Or 
Where's my, where's... Quest-related note. I would like to inform you that our construction brigade has received all the necessary materials for the further repair of one of the rooms in the camp. Here's a list of the materials we've obtained. 300 kilograms of sand, 100 kilograms of cement. Additionally, we have received a set of tools. However, I would like to draw the attention of the quartermaster to the quality of the metal saws, which leaves much to be desired. I hope that such issues will not arise with more, with more important tools. I would be grateful if you could provide us with high-quality tools to ensure more efficient work. Sincerely, Eric Fleinstein, Construction Brigade Supervisor. Risu, what is up? Oh. Uh, let's continue looking down here. Real quick. What was gleaming? Okay. A gear. <laughs> Otter. <laughs> the stereotype of the super efficient German. Like I'm lazy as shit. Get off of my case. Locked from the other side. Throw a resave on there. Cool. Falcones, have a good night. We got some more gears. Did I not come down here? Fucking awful bathroom. Is your character wearing... Holy shit. Jesus. <laughs> it sounded like the steps were made of glass. Um... Uh, Common radio. Trash. It's just a shelf full of Pokemon games. Electronics and spare parts for it. I don't need it. Okay. A crow figurine with a recess at the bottom. Oh, now I need these. Okay. 
This one so far is way better than the other one. Something's obstructing the door. There is a window above the door. You need to climb onto something to reach it. Okay. <laughs> uh, where was that save? It was here. All right, let's put, don't know what you're doing, don't know what you're doing. Put you away for now. Uh, okay. How many Dornado, are those, is this you, Dornado? Statues, items you can't pick up until it's until it's time. All artists look alike. Um. Uh, okay. Can we go put? Maybe we can go put the. Just trip over. Gunned down tornado corpses. <coughs> Okay. All right, we gotta go back. <laughs> Whatever happened to generic burned hallway corpse? I don't think I've been up here yet. Need admin roof key. What up, cake? It's going well. We're on Mortanus Prisoners. The second installment in the survival and horror anthology series. And, uh, yeah, it's going well. Okay, here's the other save point. I'm having flashbacks to that game that I need to get, that I got stuck on with all the different load zones. All right, we're back in this hellish basement here. Tornado, tornado. There's nothing down here, right? Okay. <laughs> that one game you got stuck on. The one that we did on I think is what it was called. Chris, what's up? Welcome, Raiders. I've been offline for the last week or so, so I wanted to pop back in with some... Holy shit.
creepy bullshit. Am I out of bullets? Oh, no, no. Um. They don't have a lunge like before. It's so much fucking more manageable. Tornado, get off of me! Okay, all right. Hope your stream was good, Chris. Raiders of the Lost Sark. that little figure. Let's say, you know what? Oh, that's cool. Anyway, so this is the second in this survival and horror series. And, uh, That's the toilet. It's kind of an interesting concept, even if the... Um, the dev has said it's sort of just a f like an in-between throwaway game to fund... other projects. Okay, I don't have anything for that yet. Gear, oh, this, c oh, this is for the gears. I, these are axles. Axle power. Okay, all right, we'll bring the gears back down. <laughs> oh, were you playing League Tornado? Earlier? So you went. Uh, hello. Okay. So you went from playing League. To. Guac saying you're not an artist. Jesus. waste. Oh, that was on Saturday. Oh, oh, oh. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, there's the exit. We got the bar. The cozy bar. We got the save spot. We're carrying two of... Okay. Right, I'm going to hold on to those. Let's go put them on the scales. Then we get the gears. Go back downstairs. See if we can turn on the power. And yesterday. And today. We've got accounting. Point five, point one, okay. Point five, one, and point five. Okay, so we have two, two kilograms worth of statues. I'm gonna need more statues and heavier statues. But this will do to store them. Okay. Let's 
go get the gears. Who's peacing out? Breadman. Have a good night. <laughs> yeah, we sound like we're really like tippy tapping our way through this. It's because I think we, we're playing as Justina. So we're probably pretty petite. There's us. Justina numbers 17813. We'll see. Oh, don't, oh, Breadman, you're not leaving. It's Greg. It's Greg man is leaving. Have a good night, Greg. <laughs> Try putting it in rice or jiggling the handle. <laughs> All right, we got to take the gears back. So I'm still missing a morgue office key. An admin roof key. My Wednesday shifts were cut, so I, I I can actually chill out and stay well. Nice. Dude, you're on the night shift now, bread man. With us. The night shift is where the is where the magic happens. Okay, so if we do a little of this and a little of this. All right, I might need more gears. Does this look like it fits? That looks pretty, that looks pretty snug. This is not, this is looking good, but I think it's too high.
Yeah, I think I just need more gears. Let's start at the bottom here. That looks pretty good. does not look nice. What up, Krieger with the resub, Nick Slinger? Before I chefed it, I did it for three years. Oh, shit. We're talking chefs now? Don't get me don't get me started on boiling point again. That's unfortunate. I really wanted to get in there, but I don't think I have the gears for it. Thing. That's the elevator. We've got the statues. What was that? Oh, the, the dummy interact nodes. Okay, so this place is clear. <laughs> Krieger. Almost always. Almost always. Various medical instruments. I didn't miss anything here. The neighborhood f flesh wall doing great. Yeah, bald Baldur's what? Strange, small, and heavy safe. Okay. I want the heavy safe. Give me the heavy safe. I want to put it on my scales. Okay, here's intestine lady. Fuck you. Shit, I feel bad. I instantly feel bad about that. But I didn't know if she was going to drop something for me. Sorry, Tornado. This is clear. This is all clear. Wait. Not clear. There's like a tiny little skinny door. Need a key for a doctor's room. Okay, this is rapidly turning into a goddamn key hunt nightmare. Oh, wait. Objective. Studies the physiological and psychological consequences of prolonged solitary confinement. Message. Select a group of prisoners, place them in individual cells without contact with the outside world for an indefinite period of time. Regular observation and documentation of changes. Observations. The first signs of social and emotional degradation begin to manifest after a few weeks. 
The prisoners become apathetic, developed symptoms of depression and anxiety disorders. The level of self-aggression and aggression towards others also increased. Conclusions. Prolonged isolation and exposure to Pokemon games leads to severe psychological and emotional consequences which can be used for control and manipulation of prisoners. Have a good night, little girl. Lock is broken. Doors can't be opened. Well, if I missed a tiny little fucking closet or some there, I might have missed one somewhere else here. <laughs> Lovely meme. Wow, that is like the jankiest load zone ever. All right, so here we go. Crouch. I do have a crouch. I need to remember that. That's a 5k knife in CSGO. <laughs> Got a factory new death camp fucking steak knife. Fuck yeah, dude. What, f what float? I don't fucking know what that means. Okay, so we save through the bar near the exit to clear the rest of this floor. This is locked, but let's just double check. Main door of admin. Watts is hooking up Andre. Many different books. Just pictures. This should be locked. Okay, so this floor is clear. We go. Counting, we've got our scales. Still locked, okay. Just see what, if anything happens. Float is the number tied to the wear of the skin. <coughs> I mean, I, I know the general principle of being. <laughs> I couldn't tell you what a good float is, though, for an, a given knife. Old and rusty. It won't last long. <sighs> now I can grab that? Okay, so f that, that conditional release of items is actually going to piss me off here. Is that the safe? Do I hacksaw the safe? Probably. Do I have a favorite horror movie? Um, ooh. No, but I have some favorites. Equal the scales? Maybe, Dornado. With one... Yeah, I guess with one.
Old and rusty won't last long. I guess that's not it. Shit. Original Halloween still your fave? Um, what are some of mine? I mean, how ha Halloween is great. I like a lot of I love the, the classics. Exorcist is great. I'm trying to think of um, some newer ones. I really liked Hereditary. Speaking of which, I woke up today and watched the the first thing on my phone, which was, I think, a Brazilian Instagram model hanging out a car window, flashing her tits and sucking on her fingers, and then getting uh, fucking hit with a sign as, as they drove by. She did a little dis did a little magic trick. It was like, what? I'm gonna make my titties disappear. Burn! I was like, oh shit! She did it. That's shit. Infin posted. Oh, I don't know. How did that? No, it was a story about. Uh about that shit happening. Okay. Inventory is full. Okay. fucking saw. Yeah, or it's going to be on one of those um, coming up next. Me like meme compilations. Where it's like ding, ding, ding. The guitar kick, the kicks in. I forget what anime that's from. Ding, 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 ding. fuck is that whatever why why am i looking it up i'm just going to find it to be continued that's right yeah, yeah yeah is it from jojo yeah yeah Roundabout by Yes. Oh. Didn't want to go through here. A Yes track. That makes sense why it's kind of a banger. Here, through the bar, come up here, drop off the hacksaw. Okay, we got a saw. Get back up to accounting, fuck with these statues a bit. Here. 
I bet I just need to fucking grip more statues. At least enough to either... Either I need six and I need to balance it, or I need enough to weigh it down to five. But it's all right. Good science. Just got back from e from an EMS call for a psych transport, but the patient was basically exactly like Leela from Who's Leela? Oh, shit, Meep. She was Russian. Oh, she was Russian, and it was in the Dominican Republic. There we go, dude. Nothing Brazilian about that shit. Yeah, this is a good one, Suds. Uh, the the uh, AGBS with the items is irritating, though. It's the other half of admin. find the where the roof access was what up Caesar I like that little shit that they do every now and then phone ringing the air vents rattling Here's roof access. I don't have a key for this. While I'm running around, I should be carrying the saw, just in case. I'm fucked up at a bar. I wanted to come in here and say, Sark, here's to 12 more months. Jonah? Fuck yeah, dude. I'm glad you're having a killer night. All right, let's see. Where'd he go? We're on the lookout for a... Uh, <clears throat> we're gonna... I'm looking for something to use this saw on. It's a piece of shit saw. No spoilers if you've seen it. And it can be super, it could literally be anywhere because I don't need to necessarily interact with it. I can. Use the sort of like the shovel in the last game. Like this. Could we hacksaw that? <laughs> Johnny boy. No, no, no. I, I, a few people actually, but it's more like um, uh, when people have walkthroughs open. Lord Among Wolves. Oh my God! All right, since your mom, since your mom told it to you, I'll read it, Lord. Where do bad rainbows go? Prism. Okay, I stopped reading the dad jokes. But since it was your mom dropping that heat, 
we'll go with it. Newt Newts, have a good night. I wonder if the saw... gets me through that door with the window. What the fuck was that shit? There's the save. prison PA system. What up, Tumult? Okay, here we go. Oh, really? That whole thing happened five years? Dude, I don't know. That's being posted on uh, news shit. That, may that makes me even, like, that makes me mad that I had to wake up to fucking old news, too. not seen. Seems so promising. Trash. Canisters with various liquids. Her son was apparently with her in Dominican Republic. Oh, shit. Electronics and spare parts, okay. Who is driving the car? Like boyfriend or something? Actually, I don't even fuck. <laughs> I don't even want to know. <laughs> oh, her pal. Okay. So now I have a, sa a heavy safe, a scale, a door with a window. I need gears, statues. I'm gonna go back and fuck with the safe. The safe, the safe solves 
a couple issues for me, I feel like. They were just party uh, partying on vacation in Dominican Republic. Wait, was she an actual... I don't know why I keep digging into this. Was she an actual Instagram influencer? Is that her thing? Because that's how it's being framed now. is safe. Dude, I was thinking the upstairs offices reminded me of Oppenheimer. That I need to go watch it. Oh, I stopped reading. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't blame you. shit. I will say, even though that I'm like at a uh, stall point here, it has a pretty good item gleam so that I'm not too worried about Going in, like, like, there being a tiny key in some room that I wouldn't have seen. Yeah, the, the windows are fucking creepy. Um, because it is pretty forgiving. But... So far, there's been stuff that is like you can't do until you get to a certain point. And that means like after every, what that leads to is after every development, you have to go back and scour the entire known map to see what's changed. All right, for a minute, I'm hitting the head. Coming down here. Hitting pause, playing some music. Grab a beverage, stretch your legs, to be continued here. Listen to some white bat. Alright, BRB.
All right. Yeah, the white bat stuff does sound like John Carpenter tracks. Let's do this. Let's do this. Tickle with the resub. Jonah partying. Dragon Hydra giving some love to the VOD watchers. Pie from Hell, K. I think we got Krieger earlier, Nick Slinger. Okay. What up, Cato? Gears ain't it. Hmm. Okay. Not the gears. It's not the statues. It's something with the saw. And the door. The door with the window. Because there's not a key. Oh, here we go. Yeah, there we go. Chat, I got you. I'm down here. I was fucking with the gears. Thanks, chat. Impact. Hold on. Impact. Hold the f goddamn phone. Get in here. Welcome to the party. We're playing survival and horror Mortanus prisoners. I am stalled out, and I know it's going to be something dumb. Impact. Technically, you've been in here before. So you know the drill. Oh, the safe. I'm pretty sure I can't do anything with the safe at the moment. <laughs> what up, Bard? Suds with the bits. Now you can. Let's get over here. Let's take another look at this door. <laughs> Boba. Okay, let's see what we got. Smitty. Okay, this is our This is our current predicament. Here we go. Something's obstructing the door. Can't shove that through. Electronics, radio, trash, very suspicious but useful looking shit. Okay. That was a random fucking crate. J uh, jury, thanks for the reset. Progress, but fucking also. Not mad. 
Uh, Jury, thanks for the resub. Filthy Heretic, resub, suds, and impact, of course. Let me check you out here. Realizing that she can't reach the grate above the door, Justina decides to move one of the crates closer to the door in order to try to make her way to the other side. Climbing onto the real diabolical thing about this is that the crate having an interact prompt is concealed by fucking everything else having it too. Not mad! Climbing onto the crate, she realizes that she can't remove the grate with her hands alone. She will need something to cut it with. Um, who was. I missed it. How did we get past it? It was a crate in the room adjacent to the door with the. that I need to climb up on. Okay. Alright, progress. We're moving. Also, how come I can get up here without the crate? <laughs> Justina climbs onto a crate and for some time struggles to saw through the grill. Weakened and exhausted from the torments of the camp, thin and frail, Justina realizes it will be more challenging than she had anticipated. However, she refuses to give up. After several hours of effort, she manages to accomplish it and carefully squeezes through to the other side. <laughs> Fiddlesticks, that's right. No one expects the big object. Just a projector. Who else, as soon as you see a projector in the game, the f Herc, what's up? First thing you do is run in front of it to see if you cast a shadow. First thing I do when I see it. That could get us there, theoretically. In addition to the standard supply requests for the camp, I've requested a repair kit for the mechanism in the reinforced door located in the basement of the camp hospital. The repair kit includes several gears of different sizes and diameters. To avoid further breakage of the mechanism, one of the gears was sent to the engineering department on the second floor for the quality inspection of the received product. Additionally, several gears are available in the warehouse, and one is kept in my office, which was salvaged from the broken mechanism. Holy shit! <sighs> Attack me while I'm while I'm reading papers. Not mad. No, that's not my German accent, GMath. I have a lot of German accents, but uh, this game is fully voice acted, so. just the game <laughs> germa the, the classic germa 
death camps. All right, we did all this. Um, okay, got to watch my goddamn back. What up, little hands? Okay. Do okay. Let's grab the gear. Grab the bullets. Would love a little Grim Reaper. Wait, what's our Grim Reaper called? Mortanus. A little Mortanus statue to save at. <laughs> Gmath momming it up. Okay. I might need more gears. That's sounding like I need more than four gears. Oh, I'm back in known territory here. Fuck, I hope that's I hope that's all I need. What up, Minoc? Um, I saw somebody asking if they'd explained the flesh walls or the z zombies, but they haven't. We just woke up and this was the scene. Okay. How big is this gate or this gear? Oh, it's a little tiny. Little tiny number. I'm gonna need more gears. Longster. Wait, I wanna, I wanna, fuck, I wanna take a look at that. Okay, all right. What up, Claire? Progress. Gas equipment, with its help, I will be able to open safe. All right. With its help, I will be able to open safe. dabbling arctic we are definitely dabbling no 
Okay, we're through here. Here's the door that we were... Can we get out of here now? We can. Nice. Lockers contain personal belongings, nothing useful. Joe Loss, thanks for the resub. Mistaken. Hooking up my knock. Wait, Pez with the raid? Did I miss this? Pez, what's up? What up, Raiders? Delicious milk, take a bath in the creamery. So is this just a two-stop shop here? Is it going to let me move the cart? It's actually like startled me. Wow, we went from like... Like god tier cowboys in the last game to, to just the worst... I'll take this any day, though. Dude, those cowboys? The train engineers? No, we were the train engineers. That's so annoying. Restoring the elevator's power, Justina takes a trolley, carrying a safe through the hospital. Using the elevator, she descends to the lower floor. This is another... Okay, hold on. Where the room with the gas equipment is located. With the help of a gas torch, she cuts the fast fastenings of the safe store and opens it. Doctor's room key. This is the room at the back of the tiny door. I'm not as annoyed. Uh, yeah, I, it's mildly annoying. That's all it is. That, that wasn't like a stumper like the crate was. If you missed the earlier one, there's aspects of this idea that I like. This is part of a little series called Survival and Horror. And I like the idea of little bite-sized games that all fit... Th or that, that aren't necessarily connected, but they are all part of a little overarching... Big ass statue right there. The roof key. Report on the new version of the per pervit. Wait, what? What up, fancy man? Cool looking monsters, though. So here's the thing. Hold on, before I read this. I like the idea of doing a series of unrelated horror games all under the umbrella of like survival the survival and horror title i like that like the next they're working on a sci-fi one and like an urban horror one maybe it looks like silent hillish that's kind of cool have a good night boba and these devs made the the game 
eternal evil that we thought was really good <laughs> and they're making these in order to fund eternal evil 2 and you can tell there's like moments of like really interesting or cool atmosphere in these um, but it's also mixed in with some like real clunk fancy man subbin you beat me to it I was about ready to snipe you anyway We've got Pervert Monster's drug in here now. Per pervert. Oh, we're getting the lowdown on the uh, on Pervitin. Pervitin is the concentrated extract of pervert essence that can only be drawn out by a very long ass needle. Mm. Interesting. And it's only generated. In, in in the 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 body of a pervert when they're doing something perverted that makes extracting it extremely difficult anyway pervitin currently tests so like you've got to like get the fucking peeping tom while he's in a tree and you got to be like <laughs> with the fucking <laughs> the dart pervert's like ah fuck Oh, uh, yes, dude. Six milligrams of pervitin. What up, thick and plot? Um, okay, here we go. Hold on. Report on the new version of pervitin stimulant. Currently, tests are being conducted on prisoners engaged in heavy perverted labor in the underground complex to evaluate the effectiveness of the new dosages and composition of pervitin. <laughs> There's a few more steps, but it involves heat pressure and a few rituals that involve internet. Yeah. True. The classic masturbation ritual. Under the influence of this stimulant, the prisoners do not experience hunger or pain. Confirm or deny, pervert. Resulting in a significant increase in their work efficiency. The duration of action of the new version of the stimulant exceeds the current serial version by 12.3%. It has been observed that prisoners who have already consumed pervitin themselves request additional doses of the stimulant after its effects wear off. You just can't get enough. This is believed to be associated with their priority of avoiding hunger and pain. Sudden deaths among the prisoners are mostly attributed to complete exhaustion of the body and cardiac arrest. We continue to work on improving the stimulant and its properties. God, I'm spent just reading it. Give me some of that fucking sweet, sweet perfect. They performed the rituals too hard and all their essence evaporated. I'm out of holy lotion. Um, okay, down here. My flesh wall is undulating. I need more pervitin. They perved too far and too deep. All right, we got a roof key and a statue. Let's get into accounting. Yes. All right, let's take you. And let's put you. Shit. Point five, point five. Fuck, I need another one. I need another. All right, fuck it. We'll just leave you here for now. So close. And yet, so far. This one's one. 
this one's 1.5. All right, let's get out on the roof. Maybe the roof will help us. I've put in a request to the commandant for more perfect. like that shit. I like it. Shitty bathroom. The video of Hitler tweaking at the Olympics. I have seen that. Uh, it wasn't this way. Stairs. Here we go. Hitler might have been on that person. the entrances to the underground complex is visible opposite. The hospital is visible on the left. Opposite, you can see the barracks of prisoners and watchtowers. I can't move forward anymore. And they do like a weird, uh, wow, they hit for 40 damage per. It's pretty gnarly. They're not very quick, but they hit like a truck. Next. Today, two prisoners were brought to me for reassignment. The first one was prisoner 620. Three zero nine, Considering that he is unable to continue the work of tunnel construction in the underground complex, I've decided to send him for medical procedures related to the development of effective malaria vaccines. Such a decision was made in accordance with, in accordance with the directive regarding the, the necessity of utilizing weakened individuals for vaccine improvement and their application in more severe cases of the, the, the disease. <laughs> The second one was prisoner number 1098. Due to his deteriorating vision, he's no longer able to carry out the work in the sorting workshop. Consequently, I've decided to transfer him to the sewing workshop. I can't feel my legs. I'm on so much pervertin right now. 
Morgue office key. Oh, shit. All right, progress. Admin office key. Fuck, dude. Oh, that lets us back through. Yes, yes. Yes, of course. Perfect. Other steps. Wait. <laughs> Homo Cedron. Another stairwell. Head on down. Flip it around. Take it around town. Here we go. <laughs> Dude, I I'm shocked that it hasn't crashed loading in between these two areas yet. Office. There it is. What do we got? Give me a one kilo statue. There it is. I'm not getting stuck down that hall again. Okay. All right. Nice. What else we got in here? Admin office key. Little bandage. Little bandy. Little ammo. Okay, we're flying through this now. Various document documentation that is irrelevant to me. <laughs> the Predator Hunting Grounds people ask them to let you do a German voice DLC. There's something in the trees. I saw its eyes, I swear to God. Shut the fuck up, Dietrich. <laughs> Pervitin was too strong for the Nazi soldiers. You now have to drain it from their bloated, corpusculent bodies. But they need to be doing something perverted. That means I'm going to have to strip for them. Oh, shit. Dang it. <sighs> Got to strip for Nazis. Again. With a, with a huge, like, horse trank. Hypodermic. Locked from inside. Okay, that's roof. Go back down. Ah, uh, this is it. This is it. This is it. Um, and what was this? Admin. Admin office. Okay. Man, woman. This is it. Yeah. Yeah. walking around back here. It's going to make me find all the statues in the Do, do, do. All right, 
well for now. We'll just leave these here. Okay. That guy was jerking off his guts. Ew. Um, admin office. Here we go. Let's find it. This is it. <laughs> I've got my knife is charged with Trank. Fun fact, after the British discovered Pervitin tablets on a German soldier in a downed plane, they started... Holy shit! Hold on, Pervitin history... Dude, I was reading about fucking... Pervitin here. Maxwell Danger dropping knowledge. The Americans also used Benzedrine, a similar drug. Dwight D. Eisenhower ordered half a million tablets for his soldiers before the invasion of North America. Benzedrine, I do remember that. Who did I see talking about that? It might have even been... Uh, MRE Steve might have mentioned it at one point. I don't know anything about it, but I do remember hearing somebody just talk about Benzedrine. Also, when you when you're reading shit in this, it does not uh, pause, so you gotta be gotta be quick. After successfully suppressing the recent uprising, is this German? After successfully suppressing the recent uprising during a routine inspection of one of the production workshops, the overseers noticed a prisoner whose behavior seemed excessively nervous and suspicious. <laughs> what? Up? What up, Pi? <clears throat> All of them. Yeah, all of them. I did shit that wasn't drugs as if it were in Nam. After several hours of interrogation, we were able to extract information from him that many prisoners still maintain a rebellious attitude despite the recent quelling of the revolt. Additionally, we obtained a list containing the numbers of prisoners who hold significant positions within the partisan movement. I'm attaching the list for your reference. Oh, naughty, naughty. Notes of the Cap Commandant added to the documents. Is that mission critical? No. He's just ratting everybody out. Dude, I got that song stuck in my head now. That yes track. Two kilos. Uh, that's going to do it. On the statue situation. Uh, accounting. Yeah, okay. <laughs> A posh. I just heard another footstep. Posh German. Well, maybe not. It will. It will. We've we we have the technology. Yes. Yes. <laughs> the the cutscene look. Okay. 
main door of administration. I think this is a ground level door key. Having found the keys to the exit, Justina, filled with hope to escape this hellish place, hurries towards the building's exit. Trembling, she, run towards, she runs towards the door, fearing to lose the keys that she obtained at such a high price. She grips them so tightly that her palm starts to bleed. Just two more steps and she would be free when suddenly, somewhere underground, a powerful explosion shakes the ground, causing the floor to collapse. Unable to reach her destination in time, Justina falls down, her face reflecting despair and hopelessness. In her descent, she loses her grip on the keys. Shut up! I'm Lauren here! And she disappears into the darkness. End of episode. P.S. The projects with the title Survival and More are being developed by the efforts of one to two individuals in support of the main games by Honor Games. The earnings from these projects are investigated invested, and investigated by the fucking NSA in the development of larger, more substantial, and meticulously crafted product. Not the NSA, because this is fucking Russia. It's investigated by the CIA, turns out. This game was worked on by Alexei and Vladimir. Hallelujah. I mean, I hope. There were some dropped frames there a bit. I hope they got all the pervitin. So they're making another one of these. This is all to fund their Eternal Evil sequel. Uh, which was rad. I liked it. I liked Eternal Evil. I don't mind these, but they're pretty jank. Yeah. I like this one better than the uh, Western. The Western one was not great. Had, like, cool moments of creativity, though. I like it. Anyway, they've got two more in the pipeline for this. Little anthology. I'm kind of psyched on the next one. Undead Space. And Damned City. It's cool, though. They're cranking these out. These are all going to be released within the span of six months. I mean, the first one... Oh my June. I guess I guess more I guess this one came out first. And then a month later the the western came out. So they are jamming on these. Got to shoot from the hip. Ebola. Let me look at Ebola. Bump 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 Indie Games Studio. Uh, I will. Let me write it down. I'll look. I'll look them up later. Was this the end of the Western? No, they're each little tiny standalone chapters of uh, just a an ongoing anthology series, and the dev is. Essentially, not apologetic, but he's basically just posted that these are half-assed uh, creations meant to fund uh, the Eternal Evil sequel that they're working on. Okay, on to the next, dude. What up, Ryano Raptor? You're hitting up the. You getting some late night grub?
Yeah, they were. Uh... Hold on, let's get a little music. Oh, we switch gears. I thought that for some reason I saw the Western one first. So it had been it was locked in my mind as having it's three oh it's three PM here so yeah yeah, okay, alright. Ozzy, is that right, Ryan? Dude, the Aussie time zones fuck with me. The, ga the games are not connected at all, Carrie. They're just standalone titles. Sort of like, uh, think like Halloween and Halloween 3. Now, to go deeper into the dumpster or possibly stay decent. I think we need to go deeper. Pulled this. I thought it looked absolutely abysmal. We'll see if it, uh. <sighs> we'll see what we've got. Uh, moving, moving right along deeper. We gotta go deeper. I have a game. There's a, a newer game that's out that I wanna try called Europa One, but we we might do it later. Or who knows? Maybe this will be so fucking awful that we just move right into it. But. Here we go. Murder of Crows. Looks like it was made by, like, my son. And not to knock my son, but he wouldn't put together a good game at this stage in his life. In fact, he's already planning. He wants me to teach him. And I have no idea how to do this. He wants me to teach him how to use the Unreal Development Kit so that he can stack objects up and make an only up clone. Little asshole. Okay, hold on. And then he, he says he's going to call it Rage, colon, the game. And he's like, he's like, half of the stuff won't have collision at all. What else did he say? He said there's going to be parts of the game where the screen turns 90 degrees on its side. And I'm like, yeah, that would be hard. That's just, no, that's no fun. And he's like, it's not supposed to be fun. It's supposed to piss you off. <laughs> so he's going to make the most hellish piece of shit only up clone imaginable. Hold on. <laughs> and you know who's going to run it? Nick. All right, what are we looking at here? I pulled this for the express purpose of it looking shitty, so. Try to get all the crows before disaster comes for you. Zero punctuation in that. Oh, and then there's, oh, here we go. This is always a great sign. When the about this game is just like a novel. When a dev writes their own fanfic. Here we go, get the music back in here. This is also causing Streamlabs to fucking die, so. Okay, here we go. Uh, Phil, thanks for the resub, C-Square. Any good Nico Lo Castro drama? You, disc golf dork, I love it. No, Nico's been keeping his head down over there on fucking Lone Star Discs. All the drama lately is Simon... Lazat throwing the intentional out of bounds on hole 16 at the D-Glow. Should that be allowed? I say yes. 
brilliant move. Goose with the 500 bits. You're my first gifted sub I've gotten. Watched all your stuff for years. Honor for you to take my Twitch sub virginity. Yes, dude. Give me that. Pervitin. I feel the pervitin flowing through me. Is it still fanfic if, they're, if it's their own creation? Some of them are so unhinged. All right, here we go. And it, I also like to read these before we go in, because you remember, only one sounded like the most epic shit ever. So here we go. Let's. And then what I want you to do, same as usual, remember what I've just read as we get into the game, okay? So here we go. Welcome to the sinister world of A Murder of Crows. A horror game that will take you to an eerie forest. Your mission is to find five mysterious crows in this nightmarish environment and uncover a dark secret that terrifies the forest. Okay. <laughs> That's not it. I'm not even getting started yet. You'll take on the role of a brave explorer who is fascinated by the stories about the eerie disappearances in this forest. Your journey begins at an abandoned, dilapidated, dilapidated entrance gate shrouded in swirling mist. The gate creaks ominously as you slowly open it and venture into the darkness. It's a fanfic. It's, it's a self-generated fanfic. The forest welcomes you with an eerie silence. The cracking of branches, at least there's punctuation in this. The cracking of branches beneath your feet echoes through the trees while the wind carries mysterious whispering voices. Your only ally is a flashlight, which gives you limited light in the pitch black night. So don't fight not having sight. Use your might. It's, uh, the last few were just riffs. The outlines of the trees seem threatening and eerie shadows lurk around every corner. <clears throat> Ooh. Let me just tell you, we're not even halfway through yet. As you advance deeper into the forest, you keep encountering disturbing signs. Gruesome symbols are carved into the bark of the trees and the remains of abandoned campfires bear witness to past events. Ominous sounds make you freeze. while you try to orient yourself on your way. Suddenly, you hear the fleeting flutter of... Fleeting? Have a good night, fleeting. The fleeting flutter of wings and the shrill cawing of crows. You follow the sounds and discover a weathered map with the positions of the five crows marked on it. I want that map. They are the key to solving the mystery of the forest and the only way to survive. Are you supposed to see something? No. I'm just reading a Steam page. I mean, I can put it up. But I won't. You search for the crows. Your search for the crows will take you through deeper and deeper realms of horror. You will be pursued by eerie creatures that emerge from the shadows and seek your life. John Carpenter just wailing in the background. They are creatures that are alienated from human nature and strive only for darkness and fear. You must be skilled and sharpen your senses to escape them. <clears throat> the crows themselves are not easy to find. They are masters of camouflage and have, guac, have a good night and have hidden in the darkest, most inaccessible places in the forest. You'll have to solve puzzles, overcome traps, and fight your way through dangerous environments to discover them. Each crow you find will bring you closer to the mystery of the forest and reveal another layer of terror. terror. It's just gonna be a huge open environment. This is my prediction. I'm not gonna. I'm not reading the reviews yet. Okay, fine. 
bad clone of Slenderman with a bigger map and lower FPS. And then, the, uh, of course, the annoying crow is in there. Oh, man. God, I don't want it to be a slender man. That, that's almost worse than a key hunt. What up, Medicius? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for the gift nuke. Guac hooking up MILF shake. Goose in here. Well, I mean, here we go. Just keep in mind all that epic shit we just covered. The legends. Oh, fuck. The legend says that there is a forest where there are five crows that were petrified. We What up, zombie? Jeez, fuck. I can't. <laughs> There's no fucking <laughs> Okay, hold on. Streamlabs, hang in there. Oh, in Task Manager, this is called Third Person BP Game Template. Which means this is an Unreal Engine template game. Okay, hold on. It's a sick, the annoying crow. Minus all the cacaws. It's a slender game, walking sim, but the map looks like Skyrim. <laughs> okay, all right. Here we go. Let's read it, read it quick. Legend says there's a forest where there are five crows that were petrified. If you own all the crows, bring them to the statue. A portal opens to a new environment. If you make it out alive, a golden future awaits you. Cut. Find the five crows. Bring them to the stature. And fucking Bob's your uncle. No punctuation or capitalization on any of that, but the Steam description. They went full Shakespearean. Well, here we go. Everywhere you... S <laughs> oh, Fuck, dude. <laughs> it's fucking huge. I I had a feeling. All right. Also, love the ambient forest sounds coming into my left ear. Like only that makes noise. Well, what uh ungodly um. Foe awaits us here. Uh, hold on. This is a free game. Free game. You can't knock a free game. I mean, look at this. You could get in here and enjoy this for nothing. Look at that. This is sick. So is Slender. <laughs> um. God, dude, I, th I, s 
I thought my hand was like a weird, like, flesh toned gecko or some shit. Okay. We need five crows. And there's a map. Let me just push every button here. Do one of those real quick. It's one of these. Wait. Wait. I know how to do this. <laughs> Enemy spotted. Dude, game fucking broken. All right. Hold on. Because one of these... Is fucking free camp. Remember from Snake Jump? Dude, we've got fucking recon now. Let's go see what we're dealing with over here. What the fuck is that? <laughs> so we gotta find. <laughs> we gotta find. <laughs> Fucking giant blue man group crash test dummy running running around on some Michael Jackson fucking dance pads. Okay, well, whatever. Um. I wonder if that's the, hold on, hold on. Can we, if I do this, am I go, am I back? <laughs> it's so funny that they, that more than one game we've played, they forget to take out the, Debug shit. All right, I'm gonna go. I want. I want to just do do a little bit of science here before we just snap the game over our knee. And go uh, see what this. This dude does. Hold on. Let me check my. Yeah. Computer is heating up. Oh, oh. Okay, so once. <laughs> so once Blue Man Group sees you. You're fucked, right? No. Oh, he resets. Okay, so that's the Slindy. <laughs> no, yeah, no. Oh, wait, there he is right there. Okay, can I hide in one of these little groves? Okay, all right. This enemy sucks.
Oh, Atlas is going to love this shit. This is different. Dude, I wish I knew how to use all these dev tools. Alright, let's leave our character up there. He looks different. He doesn't have body armor. Watch out for NPC jump scare C1. All right, let's look for... There's something over here. Let's go over here. Yeah, the forest sound is all coming from an area, like, out there. Nav mesh. I wonder if there's a way to mark objectives. <laughs> Could I just mark the crows? Uh, zero nav mesh. One. Use numpad, okay. Behavior tree. EQS, perception. Let's turn them all off. You know what? Maybe I maybe I'll be able to get Atlas started on his uh only up clone sooner than later. By the way, our, I'm going to just play some music because I think audio is done and Streamlabs is wondering what the fuck I'm doing too. Uh, let's see. We need something chill here. Okay, all right. I mean, this looks interesting. Another enemy we got here. <laughs> it's just, I mean, this, this model must be something that's meant to be put on like a in a toy room or an office shelf slap a little grass on the the dome okay well I have a feeling those are not what I'm supposed to be Frosty, what's up? Oh, here, you guys can't see the debug. Okay, let's do this. I guess you don't really, it doesn't matter. It's just that here, I'll show you what it looks like.
<laughs> now we're, yeah. Now we're getting into Fever Dream uh, territory. So I think you would have to, to get to the, this crow hall. You gotta go clear around. This is a sandbox game. No, it's, turns out it's a low rent Slenderman clone, but they forgot to turn off the dev tools, so we're fucking around with it. Also, this seems like a much better way to find the five hidden objects. Well, well, well. That looks collectible. Okay, one. Crow in the corner house. If we're going to say, we're going to align ourselves. This is north. Northeast corner. Yeah, Neon, exactly. But if it's anything like Slender Man, in theory, the crows are near points of interest and not just in the woods. If that, if we don't find, if we, if we, if we find that that's not the case, then, then I'm not scouring. What up, Stu? Showing some love. Got that fleeting gift. Oh, look at this guy. This looks like a POI. I did not hear that, Amir. What does uh, soft retiring mean? Germa soft retiring from Twitch. Jersey Mike's Ashoka and a GT movie zombie. I hate how they stack ads like that. Okay, we've got a crow in the... Cemetery. Sort of eastern side. The dead woods. We need to break. Okay. Well, that's different from retiring. Shits. Fucking can't kill you. Okay, there's a crow over here. East side. Red lighthouse. Focus on YouTube vids and off brand and only doing streams with no schedule. It's good. I mean, whatever. That dude's another one who does creatively driven content.
whatever fuels that engine. Um, red light house. This is the cemetery. All right, just taking some notes here. South of cemetery. All right. End of story one. Yeah, they're making another one of the one of their installments in the future will be the prisoners ep two. Uh, carry it looks like. It's not. That's not one of the ones that they have. Uh, Wish listable though at the moment. Slowing down a bit, Germa. Yeah. Okay. What is this? Is this a? This is a. Charlie's on YouTube. Yep. It did say we'd have to fight. There's got to be a there's got to be a crow in here somewhere. also be like slender where there's more points of interest than crows each game this seems crow free the other thing though is I don't so far there's there's no way to fight I don't think I don't think I'm armed oh dude I can't wait for a like a germa main channel video that's kind of hype Baron, yeah. That reminds me, we have another s two, I think, Siren Head videos to go through. Okay, so we have Crow, Crow. Row. And then like this lo weird locker rooms with nothing in them. Scuffed Slenderman would be a good way. <laughs> what up, Nick? This is what happens when you forget to turn off debug mode, Nick. Know there's more than one uh, big fella. A petite for the big fella. It's 
find where the... Oh, right here. This is where the forest sound's coming from. The tornado, the tornado alarms from Chicago. Yeah, it's the actual siren head stuff, huh? What do we got? <coughs> oh, this looks promising. to Brandon Lee. Can't rain all the time. Game beat true. Oh shit. We just hit the siren. What up Raiders? The Goblin King coming in here hot. Listen, we're involved in some. Some rather nefarious shit here. We're playing some bull. We're dumpster diving a bit. Goblin, hope you had a good stream. Thanks for bringing the crew in. This was a little game that I saw pop up that looked like it could be fun to mess around in, and it turns out to be a <laughs> the Joe Mama. Holy shit! It turns out to be a uh, slender knockoff, but they forgot to turn off debug mode. So right now I'm flying free camming around trying to find the five hidden crows I've been tasked with finding. Completely safe. <laughs> Hold on, let's get... Let's get Goblin King in here. I'm just looking for landmarks and shit. We found three little crows so far. <laughs> Zambambo. So right now we're just listening to some music, vibing, flying around. Don't forget. Remember the epic synopsis we read for this game. The Steam page of this game, I love when these like indie titles, the Steam page makes it sound like fucking Dune 3 is coming out. You have never encountered horror as you are about to. Um, I did read about the blindside shit, yeah. This is northeast. We know there's a raven up here, or a crow. Let's take a look. So I believe these, I need to find five of these. I've found three so far. Not counting the gigantic ones. And I'm really banking on each being near a uh, landmark slender style and not just stuck out here in the woods. Because if it is, 
I'm gonna look around for a little bit longer. A little while, you know. See, see, uh, see what I can find. If it doesn't look like they're all near landmarks, then we'll, we'll just move on. Because the Steam review that said it's a f find five crows in a map that looks like Skyrim is not actually far off. What we do in the shadows, you got you got show recommendations for days right now, whoever was asking. I have, I, uh, turns out I need to watch Deadwood. Never saw it. We played a Western earlier, so Deadwood came up. I need to see it. Oh, hazmat suit on this one wave is a, a necessity, yeah. I don't know, there is gigantic uh, crash test dummies running around out in the woods and there's these little ones standing here and there scattered don't know what they do yet the giant one killed me instantly dark woods on the yeah I need to finish dark wood I heard that those peeps hung it up they were working on a soccer game and they were like dude we can't handle it we're fucking done acid wizards or whatever Yeah, I love Dark I love Darkwood. I've I just haven't finished it. That's a game that is basically never not installed. Okay, let's go up and see if we're okay here. What up, Jesse? This is the same fucking sphincter face that APL and I were playing. Oddly vertically stretched, though, in that survival game. I'll clear down here. No, not leather and scrotum. It was the, fuck, what was it? APL actually posted a video. The, yeah, that. Oh, I didn't even see this. This time there's a raven on the fuck, dude, so it changes. Okay, so I really don't want to die. That's crow four. Freaky? Was it freaky? With the with the forest tower, the the tower of boning or whatever. Do we have God mode enabled? I don't think so. I don't think I can, maybe, I don't, uh, here, I'll show you what the, the debug info I have looks like. Oh, I can't even tell if that worked. Streamlabs. Is my camera in top left? Oh no, it just moved. Okay, all right. 
Streamlabs right now, OBS, is just a black screen with the preview of my stream. So I don't have a mixer <laughs> or anything right now. <laughs> Here, can I actually... Oh no, as soon as I alt-tab, it goes back to normal. I was going to show you that. All right, that's four crows out of five. Control tab. We're on spectator. I have these toggled. And then I can turn on, oh shit, I can turn on this. Shit, dude, stop running. Okay, we're back. We're back. I can't actually get the debug stuff off the screen. I can still free cam. This shit. This has coordinates. We fucked with this on that lighthouse game too. That's four, four crows. Let me just do, we're just do another little scan. See if we see anything interesting. What up, Genja? I wish I... You probably could decode all this shit. Let's go 
come up here. Stand up here. can't close the debug shit anymore. It is... Oh. Oh, that's just... Okay. You can still do this, though. Need that fifth crow region. Got one. Two, three. And there's a little house over here. Four. I know, the only elevation changes are just to keep you in bounds. Anything hanging around on the shores of the lake? In this mode, I have some type of little reticle or some shit. <laughs> Watts, no. Not at all. Does this take us to the house? It does. to the cemetery if the water kills you I mean we'll s uh, don't know there's the crow here I feel like even knowing where the crows are <clears throat> retrieving them just seems with uh, how many enemies are out there? Pooch recommended games is fucked up since I watch mostly. Oh, yeah. I mean, dude. I wouldn't trust anything to a Twitch algorithm. This just leads straight back to the Hall of Crows. Lined with enemies. There were no crows on top. I'm gonna try and just do, they, they, the road, Maybe I'll go look in that locker room area too. And there was this weird little pagoda here that, or gazebo, not pagoda. I felt like I was missing something, but it doesn't look like it. Yeah. Yeah, here, you know what? We gotta do this. This 
those white bat jams. Circle wasn't centered, Saxon. Um, there's no fifth crow. I mean, entirely possible. Follow this road. That one takes you to the house. And then look for... Forks in the road. There's Slindy. The lake does seem like a point of interest. There's definitely, definitely nothing around the edges. So hold on, let's stay on the road. Is there a preferred angle for slinging you tracks to use? Nah. I usually just won't even mess with it unless I've vetted it, like, like scared it up myself. All right, let's look in here one more time. Is this was is this supposed to be a back rooms nod? Is that what they were going for with this? White bat is an exception um, for me. Normally, I wouldn't play anything that was outside of a library that I'm. Basically subscribe to. I don't see shit in here. It's unfortunate because that just screams crow to me. <laughs> Dredge. I haven't played Dredge yet either. Well, if I can't find it, I'm going to run out there and just see what happens when you grab a crow. Yeah, and then this takes us over there. Okay, all right. Well, fifth crow is a mystery. got a Taco Bell ad? Don't get high and drive. Don't get high and drive. And Michelin. I don't know where the Michelin's coming from. All right. Yeah, there's no attack.
What up, Etho? I don't know what this means. Is this like a marker for enemy awareness or some shit? Shows polygons where AI are allowed to walk. <laughs> Sam. All right, well, let's go grab some. I wonder if this is sort of the game's way of trying to keep an enemy nearby, you know? I see enemy over there. Norcore with the resub gravy boat EDJ on that night shift. Hope you brought the hazmat suit here. takes us over to the locker room. That seems bad. just that they catch him and he dies yeah it is i mean so far i ran into one and it just does a static burst and then uh, i was dead there's little enemies all around though and i don't know what they do i guess we're about to find out Also, frames are chugging. He seems okay, though, temp wise. <laughs> Just like stock, St stock arrows. Phew. <clears throat> the green light we don't know so that's part of this debug nonsense that i've uh started fucking around with okay there were little guys all over here Okay, they're fast. Do they one-shot me? OK, 
Okay, all right, we've lost them. Like zero audio feedback. Uh, the music is... I'm playing it, yeah. It's from White Bat. Yeah, they probably saw me and are running in here. Kurgen, uh, we played a, uh, a Kurgen developed game on stream in here. Wow, so I can, oh, maybe Kurgen, maybe it's my nav mesh. I don't want to be here. This is fucking awful. Or is it all the same? Oh, maybe you're beholden. Oh, okay. Dev in chat. Dev, yes, dev. not this dev though. Kirchen's game was good. play. <laughs> I don't even know what hit me. I just, whatever it was, I deserved it. Don't we all, Ginja? Don't forget, 10 minutes of epic fucking dialogue about the game. Hold on, before we go, I wanna show you one of the uh, only up clones that I'm trying to gear up for one of our Friday night race wars. <laughs> that, that, no one but Nick will run with me, but I want them to, I want to drag them in so bad. Okay. Here, let's switch to this. I think I've already I've already seen it, pool boy, or maybe maybe not the, a new one or whatever. But Prince, Prince Mateo. Mateo, what up? Thank you, and the resub as well, and hitting that one year. You rule. Thank you. Zam is uh, subbed now. Wait, I didn't get you earlier. Oh, Psycho. Oh, Zam. Yeah, yeah, Psycho. 
absolutely right. It was fucking epic. Buster Norcore. It was not. It was fucking half baked, unfinished. Oh, dude, I have so many, Amir. That's what the race wars are all about. Okay, so this is bald man climbs up. <laughs> I want to drag Hutch into this so bad. This is single player though, I think. So we would have to do it in the style of the first one. So here's the twist. What the fuck is this? Oh, is that from when I was fucking around before? So here's the twist. You have a gun and the gun you use to launch. In theory, it's kind of a cool idea. But, here, let me show you. Pissed at me. Small boost. Aim, shoot before 0.15 seconds. Medium boost. Shoot within 0.15 and 0.33 seconds. 0.33 and 0.53 is bigger and then if you hit it within 0.53 and 0.66 you get like the big boost so it's ba basically what that equals oh look at that is you don't know what boost you're getting um every time <laughs> wow i didn't see that before hair hair loss <laughs> see i think i got the good good boost It's like that. I think I got the good one. I'm kind of money, actually. Where's the up part of it? Oh, here. Wah, 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 wah. Have a good night, Johnny. Oh, I did not get the good boost on that one. I don't know why you would uh, not have the jump. <laughs> I don't know why you would have that variable jump. That was medium. <laughs> I mean, this is shit. Total shit. And you know Nick's going to just be like, all you got to do is jump from one object to the next. And he'll finish it. He'll handily destroy us. Got like no boost there. This is better than the other one you checked out with Nick. Z 
zero mat. up Jim had a full night sleep since saying bye S we're still here oh we're still here Was that a gun <laughs> firm? Was that a gun comforter? Or was that just a gun icon? Oh shit! Fuck my goddamn ass! Oh, I did this earlier. Look, I got a point. I figured out anything inside the yellow line. Get, so I got a I got a green point earlier <laughs> a gun oh god throw one nice so do these disappear I don't know. Nick and I are going to go back in, and we are going to uh, we're going to conquer that one we were working on. I got far doing some recon, but didn't get all the way. Tab, yeah, you you get uh, in theory, I guess, more guns. Oh no, you can put your gun away. Grab that. Okay, I guess not. I haven't, Kurgen. I haven't yet. It's even the same, like little sound pack. Is this one multiplayer? No. But. But. Wait. There's more. I have a multiplayer one. <laughs> I can. I have a multiplayer one called 
just to make sure. It's really cleverly titled, actually. Because you don't want, you want people to be familiar, but also be new, you know? So, it's called Only, oh, fuck. Only Upwards with Friends. I loved when you played Hutch at chess, but just input his moves, moves into another game to determine your move. Oh, just like engine cheat, Hutch. Hey, hey, welcome to Only Upwards. By the way, I just want you to know, we're not even scratching the surface of the Only Up clones. Now, this one you c can hop into with pals. Um, with in-game voice chat. I didn't see that before. Okay, but check this out. You see that equipment slot in the bottom? It's like Phasmo clones. It'll sing back. It's going to be going for a another. It's going to be going for at least a year. Look, same dragon. What is this dragon asset? This one is much. Th it, Presentation wise, where am I going from there? I need to get onto the cup. Much closer to only up. Exclusively elevated. That's right. Have a good night, Ellie. So this game has shoving like only climb and this okay so i've passed through the balloon now you can equip the balloon and then oh this is the beauty <clears throat> Wait, Ender, what was it? Uh, anyway. Have a good night, Fett. You can take your balloon. I kept fucking it up. So I'm not 100% sure how to use it. I, I think I have to, like, back away from it. No. Yeah, okay. Now, I've planted that balloon. And it's invisible until I get close to it. So you have, imagine this is on a narrow, narrow path. So you plant like repulsor mines. <laughs> Fanciful unicorn. Yeah, I know. So if you get in front and you have a, and you have a balloon You can plant it on a, like, a balance beam. <laughs> it's so dumb. It's so dumb and so shitty. Look at this. I wouldn't know that there's already a shortcut here. I wouldn't have already, like, mapped that shit out. I wouldn't already be plotting beds on this. Fuck, dude. I have a family. I have, like, shit I need to do. I've got, I'm a busy guy. <laughs> Fuck! What up, crew? Same here. Full reset. Here's another problem. What's Atlas been playing lately? He was actually sitting with me today while I fucked around with these. That's how. That's how I have the intel. 
what's he been playing? He has been... He's been back on Minecraft. He was excited about Garden of Ban Ban 4, which came out. Yeah, there's not enough forward momentum to get up there. Um, and then... He's been playing Deadburg. Deadburg is this, like, sort of Minecraft clone. Uh, he's nine, uh, Zam. That... Oh, my God. Just jump, you fucking piece of shit. Nobody's mad. It's not. It's it's futile to get mad at something like this. That's why I don't. So he's been playing Deadburg, even though Deadburg's like a de actual dead game because the dev, I think, moved on or it moved on to like creating a sequel or some shit, even though it had potential. But whatever. Full send? Nope. Abandon the send. Baby Atlas. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was hard to believe. Nearly a decade ago. Now we're jumping. Are we jumping now? Okay, chill, 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 chill. This is weather. I didn't. I didn't see the weather. When I hopped in here earlier, there was like a full lobby, and it was chaos. Just getting out of spawn was like uh, a Fall Guys game. Uh, farce. Affirmative. Uh, yeah, the... It's a mix. The, the, sea, like, the, the upper ceiling of the demographic is getting older with me. But there's, uh... There's people, like, finding the vids for the first time still. If you can get out to those. All right, I fucked around up to just up here. I hate this. This seems fucking terrible. Just jump from object to object. Do what Nick. Do what Nick does. Find the vids for the first time. Yeah. Yeah, I have I have those vids too. I go back and watch the Germa the Germa main channel vids. Still. I'm like, man. I remember just binging these. Um, what did I do before? I think I did this. I'm a newbie. Found you when you first started Phasmo Peak Pandemic. <coughs> um... I think that I think that there was a there was a lot of people, a lot of a lot of uh, content being consumed. Okay, all right. Now, how do I make this work for me? Uh, 
there's no way I'm getting to the picnic table. Can I get over there? And it. Okay. I don't know how to manipulate these beds like in Only Up. Full send. This is not going to work. Anyway, you get the idea. So. I didn't even realize I was a fan of yours before Machinima at X-Play and Nerd Poker. Wait, what do you mean, zombie? Like, you didn't know that... Because I, I was at Machinima for Nerd Poker... Or, yeah. Like you were, like you watched, you saw me on X Play and never knew that it was the same person or something. Um,. Wasn't Nerd Poker. No, Nerd Poker is D and D. Well, I was the DM and uh but the show was called Nerd Poker D and D with Brian Posehn and Friends. So basically my buddy Brian initially it was my buddy Brian, uh our buddy Jerry who writes comics. What is Jerry writing these days? Um, and I s set up the, uh, set up the group. It's Brian's show. Oh, Jerry's writing X-Men now. He was writing Deadpool. I haven't seen that, Kurgeon. Dude, the first time I ever did this, I was just like screwing around. Uh, it was this afternoon. Atlas watching and constantly asking, are you mad yet? And taking notes for his for his game Rage, which I already told him there's already a game named Rage, so see you in court, asshole. He's like, no, mine's gonna be called Rage, the game. I'm like, I legally he might actually have a point, so god damn it. Uh, I did that dragon bed to the picnic table. I don't know how. I did fuck around with this a little because I saw there's a bed out there. I mean, we could try it, I guess. Fuck it. The orbs? I don't know. I think it's just collectibles. Can I just grab this? Sned? There we go. Full sned, even. Grab it! <laughs> Fucking godlike. Also, was that car <laughs> full pog champ furniture? Uh, holy shit, dude. The skip. That's an insane skip.
So dragging the bed down there sent me to the picnic table, and I'd still be climbing up all this shit. Onto the planes, the F-16, onto the swings. Ooh, that looks hellish. Onto the bed to here. All right, grab the balloon pickup. Leave that somewhere choice for my friends. Uh, where do we go from here? Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, is this where we go? Do we have to go down to go? Oh, there's a bed there. Oh, there's a bed. Oh. Cheeky. kind of fucking nasty. <laughs> that could easily have gone wrong. Hold on. Streamlabs. Goose. Thanks for the bits, Goose. You're good. Thank you. Yuki is renewing. Thank you. We got dead memes. Hold up. I missed. Um, let me get caught up here. Crew is in here. Jay Ryder. Jim, of course, is just woken up. To the rooster's crow of Sark stream still going. Prince Mateo with the bits. Thank you. And the, the year. Appreciate it. And then dead memes. Second week of grad school. Pretty hectic and exhausting. Just had a 17-hour day. Happy when I catch one of your streams. Makes the long days easier. Dead memes. Thanks for hopping in. Have a good night, Zam. You got a truckload of show recommendations? Here, I've got one for you before you go. Hold on. What the fuck was it called? I'm still making my way through it. Um, let me find it. I always forget exactly what it's called. Dreamcore Dreamcorp LLC. Hold on, I'll put a link. Randy? This show's so dumb. It's fucking amazing. Okay. There it is. F it's a funny show. Trip trippy funny show. Anonymous, hooking up. Clamat clamator? Cl clamat clam. We'll just go with clam. I think I pumped the brakes there. Okay. Oh, I probably could have jumped over there on that, huh? Wilfred. I did like a I did a, like a press junket for Wilfred. Was that whole thing a bouncer? Okay. And yeah, my interviews did not go well. 
That was the same. It was the same series of entertainment junkets that the um, I did for the uh, Total Recall one. The, the 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 remake where the Kate Beckinsale clips came from. I've never seen the show, though. It sounded funny. Elijah Wood was a darling. The guy, whoever the other guy was, I think Elijah Wood is is the... Is he the, the guy or the dog? I forget. Someone, some, I'm not, he's the guy. Okay. Maybe the dog. I forget who I was talking to. I think, I think it'd been a long day. I think they were over it. Show, show looks fucking funny though. Jason Gann. I, I don't remember who it was, but I don't know. Is Jason Gann? He's on Aussie, right? Have I seen him in other stuff? I gotta watch Wilfred. a ladder I don't know. ladders are not uh ladders are not only up things though i think i think th okay all right i get you i get you game it's kind of lame is this a minecraft fucking portal <laughs> okay Wait, is that... N Wait, I'm way higher now. Hold on, hold on. Is that what I'm supposed to do? I think it is. I think that's not a skip. I think that's just the way. Okay, all right. Trying to see, I'm trying to get some point of reference to see how far up this birthday cake is. Oh, well, there we go. See now I, I now I'm getting sucked into this. I can't afford to get sucked. But you know what? I could put a balloon right here. Just f just for Hutch. How do you do that, right, Mouse? I for I fucking forget. Aim down sights. I think I was fucking with that. I don't think I can throw it, though. Okay. See, that's what was happening to me earlier. Okay. Can I make... Can I make it to the big yellow balloon? Full send. Eh. 
Okay, yeah, at a full sprint, you could do it. <laughs> Not grabbing that, though. <laughs> anyway. Friday Race Force. I mean, dude. Oh, they're going to hate me. <laughs> Dimmy, thank you for the 10. Let me get some candy corn out here. Oh, it would be that would be so sick. A wipeout mechanic like skate. Fanciful. This is an intervention. My friend's silence when I texted them is that's my intervention. My friend's absence. I'd buy that for a dollar. I'm just <laughs> alone. <laughs> I've almost caught up on all the VODs, so I'll soon be able to watch streams live again. Oh, Demi. That's some that's diehard. I respect it. Foul with the dollar. Sky Knight with the tier three. You beast. Sky, thank you. Broseph, Anonymous. Let's go raid somebody. <laughs> Don't you can't miss any stream lord. <laughs> Jeez. I hope you have something like you could do while you're like doing these mega podcasts. I mean, this is a nine hour shot here. I wonder how much I'd have to pay Hutch to play. To like contractually make him play for one hour. Spaghetti with the resub. Thank you. Yeah, let's go do a raid. I've been missing the raids, too. Oh, this feels good to be, like, hot back into the dumpster, too. This is nice. I missed this last week. And I've been playing more of that game. Um, it's really dry and slow, and maybe it'll be, like, some night shift game. Uh, this one. I showed it briefly. Banished Vault. It turned out to be a little more... Um, board, like, board game than I had thought it was going to be. But I'm actually kind of into it. Um, and now that I know uh, a little bit of the like the mechanisms of the game, I could I'd feel more comfortable like showing it. Am I? Do I need a link for the Discord? I got you right here. Get in there, psycho. <laughs> oh, Dimmy, you're on Frangles. What's up, White Dad? Thanks for popping in. Holy shit. Yeah, Frangles was good. Maybe Banish Vault. Banish Vault was a great sick game. I don't know if it's a great stream game, but one of these days, since I'm playing it, I'll hop in and I'll we'll, we'll take a look at it. But. Your turbo is about to expire. Twitch notifying me. That's not acceptable. I feel like turbo's the best money you can spend on Twitch. Dude, Vertigo is fucking crazy.
Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what we've got. The murder of crows. I'm going to get back in there, debug. Debug the shit out of the murder of crows. I want to find those goddamn crows. If I do it, I'll be I'll be fucking shadow playing that just in case. They raised the they raised oh they raised not raised they raised the prices of turbo so they're re requiring you oh I saw that great that's why I'm not auto oh I didn't put that together it's twelve bucks now so it's like subbing to two channels. But it's ad free. Yeah, I mean, fuck, dude. I get how that would be a deterrent, though. It's still, I mean, to me, if you watch a lot of Twitch, I feel like it's just. <laughs> I hate that it's like a, uh, it's an artificially v valuable membership. Like, it's totally worth it to pay them more to not have ads because they shove so many ads down your throat if you don't. If you watch a lot of Twitch, though, I think it's still worth, but I hate how it's an artificially inflated value. Or not artificial. I guess artificially, yeah. It's a self-inflating. Like, what if... They're, they're like, fuck it, we'll play more ads and Turbo will be 20. And you're like, fuck! I mean, 20 bucks, or I could watch nine ads. That's still worth it. Yeah, Timmy, that, see, that's the other way. If you don't have a lot of... If you're not on, like, on all the time or have a ton of channels or, you know, you don't, you don't crave the emotes... not it's not necessary yeah I qual I'll qualify my previous statement if you watch a lot of twitch turbos turbos pretty good still I think I didn't used to and I wasn't turboed then suds how do bits work I ain't a twitch vet do you get a profit yes so tw it's sort of like bits are sort of like an easy in sight way of donating. So I get like a, I, I get like a chunk of the bits. I forget what the percentage is, 60%, half, something like that. Technically, I'm, I get more of the donation if it's a direct donation, but that also requires you going to like a Streamlabs link and it's kind of a pain in the balls. So I, I know some people are like, I'd much rather have donations. And I'm like, I totally get why. If you wanted to donate, it's easier for me. I I usually just do bits. I thought bits are taxed when the viewer buys them, but it's a hundred percent credit to the streamer. Oh, it is? Oh, I don't remember. Maybe you're right. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Clip it. Okay, let's see here. I want to raid somebody new. And our, our raid roster is so extensive at this point.
Oh, fancy man here. Now that we got a check mark. I think bits are still a percent off, but they take away less than a sub. Let's find, you know what? Let's find out. Also, most of my like Twitch knowledge is as far as like the mechanism behind the scenes. It's all from around when I was starting and it's changed so much over the last few years. I'm curious now. Presently, it looks like it's an 80% share. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. That's talking about extensions. Twitch takes roughly... Uh, is this old news, though? This might be old, but here's an old Q&A. Twitch takes 30% of the initial purchase of bits, but does, but does not take any money from bits that are donated to streamers. This is what you're saying, BVF. So if you donate 100 bits to a streamer, the streamer receives the full 100 bits, but you've paid a buck 40 for the 100 bits. There it is. See, Baron, you know. Unless that's old news. But I don't want to go down like a fucking that, that rabbit hole right now. But that's that makes sense. So that makes donos better for you. I usually do bits personally. It's just easier. I'm I'm not I'm I'm on task behind the scenes here. I'm trying to find what I want to eat while I or what I want to what I want to watch. I almost said what I want to eat while I watch dinner, but that would be supremely unsatisfying. This. This would be fun. This would be cool. Let's go. I mean. Could be some good vibes, maybe. I'm picky. If you're if you haven't been around for a lot of raids, I'm very picky with my raids. I don't take suggestions. I just track down my dinner entertainment. And I'm very selective. It's like picking them. It's like going. This is like my modern equivalent of going to Blockbuster and trying to figure out what movie I want to rent. Up and down the shelves. <laughs> and I've got a pretty solid track record. for some fun raids. Let's see what, let's see what. I did go to work. I did do a bunch of chores around the house. Okay. All right, I like this. Chip, 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 Bandale, rescue rangers. Let's go watch Bri Brad. Bri Bad, Bri Bad.
I'll put a link in chat. Let me uh, queue up the raid. When I wake up in the morning, if I pass out before you, and I'm always like, who is this random gifts of <laughs> firearms? Yes. Not Rad Brad, no. Does Rad Brad stream? I would love to say what up to Brad. I haven't talked to him in... I haven't talked to him in years. No, this is Brybad. We're going to go say what up. Spread some good vibes. I'll put a link in chat if you're watching the VOD or if you're in chat right now and you get left behind because sometimes that happens. The raid breaks. Hydra, thanks for uh, hanging. Meds, of course. Here's what we're going to go see. We're going to drop some Sark Magics in chat. If you don't have them, it's all good. Say something nice. Some cool, some cool emotes. And we'll go raise the best kind of hell over here. It looks like Brybad is just getting started on a Chippendale Rescue Rangers NES speedrun attempt. Day seven. This is good. We're getting in because he's just starting. So he's still chatting it up with, with uh, chat. Before he goes into focus mode, quiet on the GDQ couch mode. Retro. Retro. I do love the retro. Um, category on Twitch. All right. Thank you so much. Um, Friday, if not before, uh, we ride again. So let's get in there. Juki, Suds with the Reggae, Tiger Bond, Zelda, Fire. Let's get over there. Spread some good vibes. I'll see you in there. I'm going to make some dinner and hang. Here we go. We're going in. Peace out. Happen. Then I could definitely stay awake and go crazy, you know what I mean? And, uh, holy fuck, what just happened? Holy shit! Well, uh, there's way, there's way, way too, way too much chat for me to... It's for me to even catch up on this, right?